Testing, testing. One, two. One, two. It is Friday, June 30th, 2017, at 5.45 p.m. Welcome to the late game stream, boys. For once, Tyler's actually going late game. Before we do that, we have to massively sell out. Perfect. Oh, f really? Ugh. You've got to be kidding me. Um, can I get rid of one of these spaces? How many letters is this? Apparently more than I thought. Uh, this is 14 exactly. So hopefully people get the picture. We have officially sold out. <laughs> Welcome everyone to the late game stream. Harry Land, Second Man Blooms Gaming, Great Nate, Kringle Fucker, Assault, Patrick Hall, JB Plays, Alcala, Hardcore Legend, Real Name, Alex Neverett, uh, Lorenzo OKYT, QWERTY, Cody Fischel. Uh, I gotta make a code for ISAB. Very important. Very important thing going on here. So let's see, we're not gonna ban any towers. We're not gonna do any uh, custom club rules either, because we don't need that to get into late game. Uh, Bob says wait. Now we gotta wait on his ass. Alright, so first off we gotta pick our map. And the map that I think potentially is best for late game is Mines. Blue and Circle is also good, but I personally like Mines a little bit more. Just because it doesn't have that water spot overall. Here, so I'm gonna add this in. Come join ISAP. <laughs> Sell out pussy. I know, right? Who puts YouTube in their name, honestly? Well, I guess that's what we're doing. Iseb also has it. He has a much shorter, easier YouTube name to make it work. People be like, what's a YTA Lions Rock 50? I don't get it. Can you just not spell Lions? Oh, shit. I, I actually fucked up. I, was, I actually was supposed to ban towers. Oops. Hold on, let me let me ban out, or jump out because I want a specific four tower loadout. So this is actually very important to have a very specific four tower loadout. Otherwise, you won't go that late. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I said I get it. Stop sending requests. That's bad. So there's a lot of different ways to attempt to get the highest round. This is what I said and I will be going for. All right, rejoin. All right, same fucking map again. There it is. Blue Antonio Mines. Someone just donated Chris three hundred dollars. Oh, you gotta be shitting me, really. Oh, I gotta see this. It's probably happy as hell. It's probably on top of the world right now, even. Good for him, I guess. Damn, Jimmy Jammer. All right, classic, classic. Alright, so anyways, we got this in here, and this will be a test of patience and computer ability and all that shenanigans. So let's get these guys in. Late game. So the round we got to get to to actually single-handedly have the record is round 119. The tie of the record is 118, and anything else below that is certainly low. So, we could be doing Boosted Bonanza, but we ain't about that life. I'm not bothering. I'm just gonna go about normal, normal assault mode. It'll show up on Battles TV as just normal assault, so I'll, you know, I'll feel cool about myself that way. Well done. He's already goofed up. Yeah, how are you gonna pop those red balloons? Nice ninja, fam. Nice ninja. Let's go. So I'm thinking this mortar will be good enough. Yeah, I'll just get the zero one for safety. A little bit... Faster firing, so it's just extra sure to pop the red balloons. Yeah, there we go. That does better. May leak a couple blues though, so we're gonna have to probably leak a few lives along the way here and there, upgrading a mortar when we can. But we do have to kind of get income pretty fast because again, we don't have that bonus for bonanza. We don't have that mega boost where we can just 
Well, Mega Boost doesn't really help for much, Rico. We don't have playing with fire. We don't have speed. You definitely don't want speed for hashtag epic light game. I mean, hell no. That's that's no way's bueno. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get this guy to two two for safety. So we don't want to miss that blue balloon. All right, there we go. So begins the long haul. These early rounds are kind of boring, but I mean, I'll take this opportunity to answer any weird questions or comments that people may have. After all, I mean, it's a long time until it actually starts getting interesting. There may be a point where it gets super duper late. And... Well, I won't even be able to talk because I'll just be focusing on selling and rebuying abilities as fast as humanly possible. Let's go. I'm also expecting I7 and I to like fail once or twice on their early round. We're gonna do something stupid, almost guaranteed. This happens like every stream where we just do the dumbest thing. So let's see. Should I download an auto clicker, Tyler? Now nah, you gotta deal with the click, 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 click noising. I've seen 126, 128. Are you sure those weren't with macros? Because uh, I've seen 125 myself, but I know for a fact that was with a macro. And I don't exactly consider that to be legitimate, but others may. That being said, it's mainly for the Battles TV promotion. So hopefully, once this game actually gets super going, we can get everyone to thumbs us up on Battles TV, and we'll just get massive <laughs> shoutouts by that. What's the size of your big right toe? It's about 0.1 dick lengths. You do the math. So a macro, for those who don't know what it is, is like a computer program that allows you to, you know, hands-free be able to sell and rebuy a tower. A tower that's useful to do that with is the mortar ability, because mortar stall will stop balloons in place for a very short amount of time. And if you have it doing it, lightning speed, aka like having, you know, mortar ability go off, you know, maybe 30 times a second or something insane like that, right? Then, well, you can't replicate that with like human efforts. And you will get much higher because the balloons will be infinitely stalled. Oh, no yellows. Sorry. Whoops. I am kind of defending. Kind of want to get this guy up to... Yeah, I'm going to get this guy at 3-2 so we can actually defend yellows. Because, we're, yeah, we're leaking a little bit. Kind of annoying. Sadly. It's just the way it is. I'm going to continue leaking here. I'll just place a road spike. Do I get a ninja up right now? I'm not entirely sure. This map's kind of kooky. We're going to leak quite a few to yellow balloons. God, I'm going to leak a lot to yellow balloons. Do you mind? Jesus Christ, man. I'm going to retarget this to a slightly better spot. <laughs> 31 lives. Good lord. Okay, let's get a double shot. Double shot's good. I didn't realize I said I bet you had a ninja, so that helps him out quite a bit. So I'm not going to send out pinks. Right, that's definitely a dick move. Because we're gonna need the, you know, we're gonna need the little defense as possible. Alright, there we go. We're defending a lot better now. I'll be at a nice, comfortable 28 lives. Someone just got goes on the bell TV and says, "Wait, have I been following the wrong Tyler?" They'll know. I'll make a video about this too, and they'll see the YouTube Aliens Rock 50 and be like, "Ah, yeah, I guess it makes sense." Oops. Sorry. I sent pinks. After I said many times I wasn't gonna send pinks. Alright, do I get a balloon jitsu? Oh, we almost leaked another two lives. It was very close. Incredibly. Incredibly close. I wouldn't mind getting a balloon jitsu. Uh, I said I was electing to go for a second mortar. It's not a bad option. Nah, yeah, I guess we're barely defending the few balloons to get through. I'm just watching it was like a hawk. Like, it's one of these days something's just gonna accidentally slip through and kill me. It's gonna happen. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, that, that hurts. Eight lives! Holy crap, I look late to sneeze for like two seconds, and we lose, go down to seven lives. Oh, we're gonna die. JK, we're at two lives. Good look oh, up, we're gonna die now. Oops. Alright, well, we saved up for our Balloon Jitsu way too late. There it is, boys. Round 14, world record. <laughs> oh shit, did my Steam crash? Okay, never mind. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> well, hey, I did call it. Oh, let's try this again. All 
Alright, so... I've learned one thing this time. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, God, here comes the chat spam. Well, same thing over and over again. Do I want to maybe put my mortar down here? Mm. So there's like two good spots. I'll just keep it here for now. I guess I'm just getting a balloon jitsu next time. <laughs> oh, man. Feels bad. Maybe I should just go Bonanza. Bite the bullet, not give a shit about defense for a early game. I just want it to feel legitimate, okay? Feels more legit this way. Hey Tyler, how are you today? Not too bad, Professor Klux. Welcome to the stream. Oh shoot, I'm gonna leak one life, aren't I? Forgot to get Bernie stuff. Yeah, but I mean today's been an alright day. Any day that I actually upload a video ends up being a good day, because that means I actually put, did work. Tyler, when you finish the bloopers video, if everything goes according to plan, that's going to be our only blooper. Hopefully we don't fuck up twice. If we do, I'm actually going to be pretty pissed. Like, it's going to be... It's going to feel bad. It's going to be actually really upsetting. Okay, I'm going to target this guy down here. Mortar explosion is actually huge, so I think I can get away with having it here. We'll see if uh, that spot catches everything on this path. Yeah, it does. Perfect. Need to be more like Molt. Yeah, of course. I'll try on that. Keep it PG, but have someone leak me swearing over Skype. When's the next Balloons YouTube tournament? Well, you're in luck. It's tomorrow. Although, not everyone there is like a YouTuber. It's not like a show match. It's an actual big tournament that I... It's probably going to last like a whole day. I haven't decided if I wanted to join or not. Like, I'm not sure if I'm really interested. It also would mean I'd have to get up 10 a.m. my time, which, you know, is super fucking early. <laughs> uh, no, but... Yeah, I'm not entirely sure if I want to join or not. I mean, we'll see. Maybe guys will see me there. I know you'll see SJB there. And Bruno Locky be the ones hosting it, of course. But not so sure about other YouTubers. Alright, on the bright side, we're not leaking that much this time. Are we going to defend these yellows, though? Yes, we are. Alright, all we need is for the burning stuff to hit the yellows, and we are set. Going for hashtag epic early in the tower? Yeah, last game we hit the world record of hashtag epic early game. We got, we got round fucking... 14? 13? I'm not sure. Chris is drunk. I'm aware. That's actually why I started my stream now. I was going to stream earlier, but then... Uh, I realized Chris was getting drunk, so I didn't want to overlap much. He's going to end his stream soon, though. He has uh, girlfriend's friends that I hang out with. So... Alright, this time we're learning for our lesson and only sending greens until we get 900 eco. Then I guess I'll buy a ninja? Hire a samurai. Or a second mortar. Second mortars are good. Second mortars are definitely good. Oh! Okay, so this is actually... This kind of sucks right now. So regen yellows are going to cause maybe a little bit of pain and suffering. Yeah, our ninja cleared up pretty well. I said didn't road spike. That may help him out a bit here. Oh, Jimmy doing $300 so Chris will stream longer. Ah, gotcha. That'll do it. Nothing keeps a streamer going <laughs> like a $300 donation. That's insane. I think that's the highest Chris has ever gotten. Also one of the highest I've ever seen, except on like 2D stream, when people steal their parents' credit cards. Don't do that, by the way. Never steal your parents' credit card and donate on a stream. Oh, I just realized I'm already maxing eco for blue or green, so I'm going to yellow right now. Ah, oh, crap. The fire department's coming for me, boys. It's over. It's been a good ride. I'm pretty sure I can defend y'alls right now. Yeah, things are looking a lot better. This new mortar spot's also a lot better than the past one, too. Oh, I could also upgrade my mortar to second... third tier on the left? That's really not needed, though. I really 
It doesn't look like it is. Uh, I said seems to be leaking a little bit. Yeah, okay, I'll switch over the greens real quick while he saves up a bit of defense. Yo, I said you're gonna want to move your mortar a bit further out from the corner. Oh, hey, Newt, Newt. Oh, no message. Just a two dollar donation from Jambite. No message. Thank you so much for those two dollars, Jambite. Because of that, I will make it past round <laughs> fourteen to round fifteen. New record, boys. Anyways, I did get the Blue Jitsu Ninja just for safety. I mean, we'll 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 be fine. I think we'll be fine for a long while now. Blue Jitsu cleans up really well. I may actually switch up the pinks once Izab gets his Blue Jitsu though. I'm gonna upgrade this. Then I'm gonna send pinks. Yeah, there we go. There's his Blue Jitsu Ninja. Let's see if he handles pinks. I want to be extra sure. It's kind of actually a bad round to send pinks on. Maybe I should have been a bit kinder. Eh, looks like we're doing kind of fine. <laughs> yeah, congrats, new purpose personal best. Should we try just surrender now? I don't think we're gonna top this. Oh shit, round 17. This is pretty good. Turn off BT music and put on cost custom music. I could sing. I'm not gonna do custom music though, because that lags my internet. Although, lagging my internet may be a good thing. I just don't want to disconnect, alright? I'm terrified of like getting to round 118, then just my internet saying, fuck you, Tyler, we're gonna stop working. Like, wouldn't that suck? Everyone everyone would be so pissed. Rightfully so. That would be quite possibly the worst possible thing that could happen on the stream. Alright, so I said, remember, round 22 is ceramics. I think I'm gonna buy myself a second balloon jitsu so I don't die to that. Or a big one. Big ones are nice. What would I rather have? I think I'd rather have a big one. I mean, balloon jitsus are fun and all. I'll start saving up round 20. It's not gonna get late game without the glue gunner. Seaman shooter OP OP. Yeah, I'm gonna just start saving up for it now. We'll do like a little bit. Okay, let's see if I can do math. So 27, so that gets to 64. All right, so I need 75. Meaning I can go down a bit. So right about here, there we go, the big one. Damn, that's pretty big. All right, now we're just set. We're gonna beat those ceramics. We got a few rounds earlier than I intended to, but I don't really care. Eco is eco. Sure, this is the best loadout? Um, to be honest, it's kind of a flex. Like I said, I don't really play much late game. As you can tell, I mainly prefer to just do like rushing games on live stream. I do obviously know a thing or two about late game, but as far as the best loadout go, Super Monkey, Ninja, and Ice Tower are mandatory, 100%. Then for fourth tower, it's kind of tough. Either Mortar or Ninja, or sorry, not Ninja, Sniper. Sniper is great because you can get those uh, fourth tier snipers and stall the ZLGs. Get like, you know, 50 of them, have them on close, and they'll basically act like the Bloom Shepherd. Or you could just have Mortar and do Mortar stall. Also, it makes your temple so much better. You get 20 billion times tempo sacrifices. Like, your temple sacrifices are just so much better. So, anyways, Ice Hab is starting to place down his Super Monkeys already. I should start doing the same while I made myself a guide for temples. I couldn't actually figure out 12, although, again, I didn't put too much effort into it. There's a really easy way to get 11 temples on this map, although 12 is kind of tough. Like, you gotta really squeeze them in. You gotta, you gotta try. So, another uh, benefit to the mortar over the sniper is if it lags for any reason. Either my internet's lagging or ISAB's computer is lagging. That's probably two potentially likely things. Then... What will happen is that the game will go super slow, allowing us to have so much more time to just do mortar stalls. We'll go crazy on those. Honestly insane. He just said snipers suck. Well, I mean, this is a different base, basically a different kind of game. Hashtag Epic Lake game. If we get the record, like if we beat the sniper record with the mortar, then yes, yeah, sniper does suck because you can just replace it with mortar. If we don't, and we don't manage to like screw up somehow, like we don't accidentally sell half of our defense when we get super late. But yeah, I guess Sniper will be better. We'll see though.
Okay, when I place towers, I'm actually I'm actually try, gonna try to go for pixel perfection. Got my first uh, super monkey down there. Let's see where else? I'm gonna want to sell that mortar eventually. It's not in the greatest of positions. It's fine though for now. It'll be okay. So I camo pink, so I'll just get me a second blue jitsu. Better safe than sorry, right? Should be okay though. Plus those ceramics, I mean, it helps out against that. Get a super monkey right about here. There we go. Why not keep mortar back when you have it? Well, I think for the big one, the spot we currently have is better. Because it has this giant bend and this giant bend. Like, I don't know. It, it doesn't really matter one way or another. Also, just get a robo monkey. Like this is this is gonna have to go eventually, but again, I think we're just playing it super duper safe. Yeah, the rogue monkey is just basically just there for safety. Uh, I know mobs are gonna come, and the blue jitsus have screwed me over before. It's kind of weird. Sometimes they don't distract the ceramics, or sometimes they don't aim at the mobs when I want them to. Yeah, I mean we'll see. Is the stream gonna be private? Uh, I think it actually will afterwards. Instead, I'm gonna make it into a video because I mean, if we do hit the record, then yes, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a great video. Trust me on that. Super monkey here. I may need to replace that one in the bottom corner. Let me change that up a bit. You know what? I'll get that guy last. All right, perfect. We gotta keep placing these guys. We gotta keep getting eco. We don't have that much still. What do I want to stop at? Twenty thousand? Thirty thousand? Don't know. Where is your bike, Nate? Uh, I replaced it to uh, sell out instead. If this game makes it to the top of Battles TV, you guys can actually go watch it live and upload it right now. Yeah, uh, make it to the top of Battles TV. We'll get a lot of potentially a lot of. Uh, traffic to our YouTube channel. Hell, I mean, we could get more people watching it live. If, if it's at the top of trending and it's still live, people may see a YouTube channel, search it, and watch us play while it's going. That'd be pretty dope. <laughs> like, how many people do we have already? Damn, this is this is already a pretty huge amount. I have a feeling we have more than SJB stream. Who would have thought? People love them, uh... People love them hashtag epic late game, boys. Stop at 10k eco. I think that's, yeah, that's a fair amount. Oh, shoot, I should probably get me a uh, artillery battery. Yeah, let's just get that. I'm gonna just activate it so we can get those. Oh, what the? Since when does the artillery battery not pop camel balloons? Did you guys see that? I activated the ability because I wanted just the camels to be popped automatically without having to retarget it. They didn't pop. And the mortar stall is supposed to pop five layers. The hell? All right, well, that's just bizarre. That's fine, I don't mind. Not a big deal. All right, so this is the round where all the ceramics come. Let's make sure we don't uh, pull a Tyler here. It's a lot of balloons. I think I'm all right. Yeah, I'm pretty good. If I have to, I can just upgrade my bottom corner super monkey to a sun god. I should probably do that. I mean, I could do that. Oh, I can upgrade this guy, Sun God. Just get that. There we go. Keep going on this eco. Get camel detection on your ninja. Oh, shit. Oh, I forgot that. Oh, damn. Doesn't kill the ones in the tunnel? Is that why? Potentially. I mean, it's just an odd bug. I mean, you would think it would pop them regardless, but I, I guess clearly not. This is a world record round 333 by Reckler. That is the old world record, yes. You have to realize, though, as the game's been updated, there's been a lot of changes to make late game a lot harder. The biggest change is that mob class balloons, they increase in health and speed as the game goes on, and they increase by a lot, really quickly. Much more quickly than they did when a Reckler hit round 333. So, 333 is no longer attainable, and generally, for late game records, you go for a new record every time a new update comes out. That's the general rule of thumb. 
because another thing that changed late game was Chipper getting nerfed. Bloom Chipper used to be able to suck in ZOMG, so you fill up the map with these Chipper ability monkeys, and you would just completely destroy, well, you, you just destroy everything, I guess. You'd stall them. Another big thing was the village glitch, which allows you, allowed you to do hypersonic towers. That was something else. You could have your spike factory shoot like 10 billion times in a second and just demolish around 140 plus CMGs. I wouldn't be surprised if like around 200 was possible at that time. It was insanity. All right, so now we're now we're we're done sending Eco, at least for now. I'm gonna buy my super monkeys. Just make sure that the temple doesn't sacrifice here. All right, this looks good to me. Get my guy up here. Maybe down a pixel. All right, that's good enough. Now, all right, this is annoying, super monkey. We want to get into this top corner without activating the boost. Those who come to my stream often know know that I suck at this. This is generally awful. <gasps> yes, we didn't boost. Praise the lord. I'm just gonna place this guy here. Good enough, let's just make sure. It's whatever. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we need three more super monkeys. Meaning we'll get one here. Newt Newt! From Fred Morgenstein. Thank you so much for your donation, Fred. For those who couldn't hear, he said he's back, and could I use the aircraft carrier? Well, I will try to fit it on this map, but uh, I think there's a bit of a lack of uh, something something to make it work. Can't seem to put my finger on it. Yo, well, thank you for the $2 donation, Fred. Super appreciate it. MVP, kind of, tied with jam bites. And I'm just gonna place this fucker here. Yeah, this won't sacrifice much. I don't know, so this is my current temple setup. So I'm actually gonna work on it right now. Let's see, we got, we gotta have a certain amount of money of, gotta have enough money of bomb sacrifices, enough money of ice sacrifices, and enough money of miscellaneous sacrifices. So the first temple we're gonna get is the one just smack dab in the middle. And kinda just sending eco in the meantime. Let's see, is this enough? So it's 4,000, we need to get one more. So you want like the sell price to be about, oh I don't know. 24,000. You need $30,000 of each. So if you do the math, that comes out to like, you know, 24,000 sell price worth of miscellaneous, 24,000 sell price worth of bomb, and 24,000 sell price worth of ice. I'm like, what am I forgetting? Also, let's be sure that our tower actually, or super monkey actually sacrifices everything in here. I'm gonna just keep using ice ability and all that. And I actually have to buy one more mortar. It's a little frustrating. Can we fit it here? Well, actually might not be able to. Let's, let's hope this, this mortar gets sacrificed. Alright, now, here we go. First temple. Easy peasy. Alright, taking care of that. Let's go. We got a pretty sweet temple right here. Now so that's just going to clear up most of these balloons. So actually, this guy should be on first, I don't know what I was thinking. I'm going to keep activating Ninja in the meantime, too. So we're also going to keep building up our eco. So we got one temple down. I'm going to do like the most unsure temples first. Like, I want to be extra sure or that I'm not sacrificing this temple to this guy. Like, shoot, isn't the middle pixel in? Doesn't look like it. But we're going to do that temple next, because we don't want to be super late and accidentally sacrifice a temple to another temple. That would be bad. That would be really bad. I thought it was 30,000. 30, it is. I said 30,000, didn't I? The sell price is 24,000. But I mean, that's because like the sell price is 80% of the actual price. If you do the math, 80% um, of 30,000 is 24,000. Math checks out. I can math. I'm going to keep activating these ice abilities. And shit, I should also actually mainly focus on the temples at the top so I can see what I'm doing. That would be smart. Because, yeah, I have a, actually a really hard time seeing what's going on. Activate this again. And just get a third sabotage in its range. Alright, get that. Now we gotta get mortars. 
I think this side is more is cheaper or more expensive. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. We also have three road spikes in case we want to, you know, road spike the bloody ZOMGs. It's gonna be excellent. I can't wait. All right, please don't sacrifice this temple. I swear to God. Good, excellent. Two temples down. Nine more to go. Quality here is crap compared to Balloon's TV. Well, I mean, I can only do. I can only do 720p. Go watch it on Bloom's TV if you really prefer the quality there, but stay for my commentary at the same time too. It's a good it's a good mix up. Also, if you are on Battles TV, be sure to thumbs it up because we want that to the top of trending so everyone comes to this stream. Yeah boy. Alright, so I'm gonna get this guy now. I'm also gonna buy Sun God here. Just cause. No reason really. I right, keep buying these guys. Good. Maybe I'll just get this blue jitsu. I don't know. Freaking, where's my ice tower? There we go. Activate this. Activate this. We're just perfect. Is this in range? I don't think this guy's in range. It's close, but not quite. Oh, fitting in triple mortars is gonna be really tough for this temple. Actually, can we do it? Oh, you know what I might do actually. No, that doesn't make sense. Let's just get this guy here. Cross our fingers, it's in range. It might not be, it really might not. I think I'm gonna sell some of these ices and attempt to fit a third mortar in. Right about here. Where are you? Okay, still an ice in the way. Is there a ninja too? Another ice. Cannot fit. God, why are these guys so fat with a pH? Are there more I need to sell? Okay, I guess so. Alright, so this is this is kind of annoying, but it's okay. We're gonna we're gonna replace these again. Get another one here. This temp this temple actually may not get the full sacrifice. I guess that's an advantage of going bomb over mortar. You can actually fit full bomb sacrifice in there. Yeah, we're not gonna do much better than that, are we? Feels bad. It's okay though. It's the circle of life. Ice shard, and then two. Really, gosh, trying to fit these guys in is something else. Oh, I can fit one up here. Brace the lord. All right, yeah. So I think we're just gonna have to yeah, be one mortar short. It's unfortunate, but it's what we have to do. Why not use a Techno Terror's miscellaneous? It takes up less space than the ninjas. It does. I mean, it's kind of close, but... Plus, I like just having a sabotage supply lines at the ready, if needed. That way I can just slow down everything. Make it easier for the temples to destroy. Alright, where are we? Here we go. Now we fit all our big ones in, now we're gonna place our ninjas. It doesn't matter what the miscellaneous is, though. All it matters is how much it costs. Like I said, I just like having the abilities at the ready. Might as well, because eventually we're going to want, you know, five, four or five ninja abilities, and then like 17 ice tower abilities to slow everything down, make it easier for our towers to defend, you know, the drill. Alright, temple time. So I'm going to get this guy on strong, actually. I want some of my temples in the front on strong. Alright, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Now, this guy here. I'm not going to upgrade him yet. So now we're going to place our towers. So this one, we may accidentally boost during this. Feel free to facepalm if that happens, but I'm a little bit worried about that happening. I'm going to ice tower slow this stuff down. Third mortar placement. I think it won't... All right, good. Good, good, good. I'm gonna get that to artillery battery, actually. Good, good, good. Didn't boost yet. It's just yet, though. We still have a chance. 
So what I'm doing is clicking and dragging my mouse off. So that seems to kind of work. Shoot, are we going to be able to fit ice towers in here? We actually might not be able to. So we still need to fit one more balloon jitsu and then three ice towers. Maybe on top of this temple. Right about, you know, right about up. Oh, I saw it. I saw it. There we go. And I'm going to get this guy to vile, vile freeze. Perfect. So let's the OMG down so we can defend it more easily. And see where else we can fit our ninjas up here. Gosh, this placement thing is really killing me here. Alright, another sabotage. This is good. Now another ice. We fit it here. Perfect. And we hit 600 viewers on the screen. Or on the stream. Doing solid so far. We're only around 52. Like, we still got a long way to go this game. I really am starting to doubt the fact that you can fit more ice towers here, though. I think that's it's, it's going to have to stay like that. It's as good as our temple's going to get. Maybe one more try. Scan everywhere. Yeah, I don't see it. I want to believe, but not happening. All right, we got another temple. Let's keep building up our eco. All right, so now we have five highest level temples we can get. We're going to keep going on this. We want our temples before everything else, obviously, because if we try to place more other towers, well, <laughs> they'll just they'll just be they'll just be sucked up by the temples. So that's totally not going to work. Why not Bonanza? Because you touch yourself at night. Alright, we got our big one. Do we have a third big one spot? We actually may not. Oh, we do. Newt, newt. Potato, potato, potato. One dollar donation for potato. Good lord, how many potatoes are there? This is so many. What in the deuce? Potato pot. Thank you so much for a $1 donation. Every little bit helps. Mr. Potato, I appreciate it. Damn, with donations like this, maybe I'll do hashtag Epic Lake game more often. <laughs> Alright. Sixth temple. Everything is going smoothly now. Placing, getting everything for that temple is actually really easy. Thank God for that. I'm gonna activate another sabotage. Would village help at all? I mean, village surprisingly isn't too bad of a late game tower. I think mortar is still better though. Like you want that extra temp temple sacrifice, at least for the most part. And then the mortar stall is also very good. Anyways, I'm doing this guy next. I'm just slowly working my way down. Because I know the temples at the bottom will definitely, definitely, definitely not sacrifice other temples. But these second close to the bottom temples may possibly do something. I'm not sure. We'll see. That's really only way, one way to find out. Zero Zero Doubt Monkeys are better going late game. Damn, I should have tried that. I'm with the master of the Zero Zero Doubt Monkey, too. Damn. Alright, good. Did not sacrifice the temple. It's going excellent. We're actually running low on money, though, so I'm going to keep rebuilding my eco. We kind of need to. Click, 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 click. Very loud clicking noises, I know. Oh, uh, where can we fit another mortar? I may have to just sell this ice, bite the bullet, eat the vagina. I mean, place the mortar. <laughs> um. On the right side, the ZOMGs are hardly getting anywhere. Like, I'm really not worried about dying anytime soon. So we're not going to do anything stupid. 
and you know die on round 14 like who the hell would die on round 14 some total noobs am I right we're not gonna do that we're not gonna die on like round 60 either Got a long way to go all right next temple and now we legit do not have money for next temple that's crazy that's ridiculous So, do you edit the mouse clicking sounds out, or should I say lessen the sounds to make them more audible? Or less audible? No, but I should. I don't know if there's an easy way to actually do that on OBS, though. Currently, I don't know how. So, if anyone knows an easy tutorial of how to edit noise clicking sounds for live streams, hit me up. Like, on Twitter or Discord or something. I'd love to find out. Because, really, that'd be super useful. Now, what I'm going to do... Sometimes you can actually place like towers on top of temples, which I think is hilarious. That's gonna be pretty useful for getting late. We're gonna need our towers on top of the temples. I just realized for some of our temples, they didn't actually have max miscellaneous sacrifices. Shoot, how's this guy? I can't see what his range is like because there's a lot of temple shooting here. I don't know if this guy's gonna be sacrificed. Whatever, I'm gonna keep it. And we'll just kinda keep buying some Isis. There we go, one Isis. Damn, where my Isis Tower's at? Damn, why the mortars have gotta be so fat? Oh, let's place this down a bit. There we go. Oh, why did you not use a helipilot glitch? Well, that's interesting. Maybe I could have had helipilot as a fourth tower instead of mortar, potentially. I'm not sure. Anyways, I'm really kind of regretting uh, taking bot or mortar over bomb at this point. God, the mortars are just so huge, you know. Can't fit anything in here. Ah, this guy's not gonna be sacrificed. Alright, we got this guy. I'm gonna just activate him, activate, you know, some ninja abilities and all that goodness. Place our mortar as far down as humanly possible. What if I place the mortars first, then upgrade them? Is it easier then? Try this. Alright, place this guy. And if we can place in a third mortar, it looks like the footprint is smaller. But I kinda doubt it. Oh, saw something. There we go. Perfect. Maybe sell some of these ninjas for another one of the mortars? I guess. Alright. Now we'll place our ninjas. There we go. That looks like a bit more space. Okay, awesome. Could have done this in Mega Boosts. Yes, you see, having 40 temples isn't as good, though, as having just a bunch of max temples. I genuinely think max temples are better. Ah, uh, come on. Let's reach. I don't think this ninja is going to be sacrificed. Damn, the the uh, mission of finding open spaces continue. Anyone want a song request, Blank Space by Taylor Swift? Because we could use one of those right now. Right, what about this ice? This ice is not the most helpful ice ever. Alright, we're gonna place this guy as 
far left as we possibly can. Now it's far down. That's it. Oh shoot, some ZMGs are actually kind of getting far. <laughs> Alright, well let's put a stop to that. I didn't realize they were getting so far. Don't worry guys. We will be alright. Alright, let's go. Let's hope that everything got in this range got sacrificed. It should be. I think we'll be alright. Okay, now we're going to destroy those. And now we can focus again on placing our mortars. We're going to just... No, we, we missed the ninja. Oh, that stinks. Yeah, I don't think there was a way to get that to Max Temple. Damn, feels bad. Because if it's not Max Temple, it misses out on a lot of popping power. It's actually kind of ridiculous how that works. Oh, well. That's fine. This temple, this temple is going to be max for sure. I'll be really surprised if it isn't. Maybe I could use a super monkey instead of four ninjas? I don't know. Sweet. Ten temples down, one more to go. I actually might sell this. I don't know, I'm almost considering selling this temple to fix it. Because actually, now that I think about it, right, one super monkey is more space efficient than four techno tech or four blue jitsu ninjas. I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Right, we're gonna get this guy here. Ninja Kiwi get mad at Dillabike so he changed his name. Nah, I changed it on my own accord. It, it may be useful if I'm in the tournament tomorrow, too. Ninja Kiwi actually would want me to change my YouTube username, or my battles username, if I was in the tomorrow's tournament. Because, I, I guess, you know, kids are watching, which is a fair enough reason. I'm not going to argue with that. Ah, uh, shoot, I actually made me slow this down. Let's just buy a ninja here, too. So we can be smart and safe. Oh my god, I sold the temple instead of the ninja! Fuck me. Okay. Let's replace this then. This is awful. Absolutely terrible. Why? I didn't even want to sell a temple. I should ask you if you're sure before you sell a temple. God, now placing this is going to be a pain. Because I can't see if it's sacrificing anything or not. Aw, oh, shoot. Ah, oh, balloons are kind of getting far too. Damn, I have so much less pop bug. <laughs> I can only sell the temple. Okay. Don't panic. We're going to defend now. Alright, so right now it currently does not sacrifice. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> ah, so many bloopers, but hey, at least we didn't die from this blooper. Alright, so I think this guy's safe. Yeah, right here is safe. Excellent. Alright, let's get our... We're gonna get Sabotage Ninjas first. God, I might as well get a... Ice ability. Why can I... Why am I so terrible at actually finding spots to place things in? Damn. It's frustrating, you know? Alright, well, let's get this temple before we worry about anything else. Because this temple right in the middle is actually really important. Also, I have an opening, so I'm gonna... This opportunity to place my mortars. One, two, three mortars. Excellent. Alright. So those DMGs are pretty fast. Newt Newt! He changed it up a bit from last time. It's got the potatoes in there. Ah, shit. Alright, take two. Let's make this a temple and hope it doesn't sacrifice anything. Good. Excellent. Alright, now we continue with our normal ninja, you know, our placements and everything. Let's get more ice towers down here. This is what we want. There we go, got one here. And one more ice, and actually we'll have a perfect temple in here. Perfect. I don't know if that's in range. I 
don't no it isn't it definitely isn't uh, where, where, where can we place our ice tower we can't place it on top of the temple that's not gonna help us sell this guy for just maybe more ice All right, I'm gonna activate absolute zero first sell the ice tower get us a ninja ability which I definitely want and now we're gonna place two ice towers there we go, this is better. Yes, sweet. I think, mm, maybe won't, but we have better odds. All right, final temple down. Yes, it hit all the ices. Excellent, let's go. Let's just kind of keep placing these guys then whenever we can. Sell our ice. And activate a ninja ability too from time to time. So now, now that we have all our temples in, we got a sweet setup. That means we're gonna go for techno terrors like crazy. We're gonna have to fit as many of these as possible. Now the now currently we cannot see, which means we have to place these blindly. So lower this until we can't no more. I think we're gonna start with zero zero super monkeys. See another one here. I'm gonna just activate this ninja to sell it. Activate an ice. Kind of do that. Slow down the rounds. And make sure we're selling the right tower this time. Sweet. We got a couple techno terrors. We're gonna keep going on these though. Because every free space we're gonna want is just gonna be techno terrors. Then in the tiny crevices the techno terrors can't fit in, we will have ice and ninja have a st space for mortar stall micro oh, this is true this is very true when we mortar stall micro i'm thinking down here here seems like a good spot because it's actually like really close to the towers too so like, currently all right uh is this guy right here can we fit another in this crevice it looks like no so that means we got a techno terror we want this on strong i suppose useless to have it on first just Popping random balloons. Want it more on strong. All right, activate these abilities. All right, now we actually have a nice clear opening, so we can see that we can actually fit some super monkeys in here. I'm gonna move this over a bit. The old zigzag method. Excellent. Oh, geez, it's still. This is actually still getting pretty fast. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just activate sabotage at this point. And look for our next super monkey placement. Looks like here. And then we're gonna go for another one. And just kind of keep alternating these to the top. I'm being really sloppy with my placement, so I should fix that. Ice tower ability. Ninja ability. There we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna just keep making these zero zero super monkeys. Don't need to upgrade them yet. It's really not that important. All that's important is getting them down. Because when they're placed, I'll just be able to click randomly until I find one, right? But if I'm placing them when a bunch of ZOMGs are there, then it's going to be super hard. Alright, can we fit one up here? Yes, we can. Excellent. Round 77 already. Jeez, these 44 minutes went by fast. Holy crap. I did not realize how quick that would be. I'm gonna upgrade these now. At least some of them.
Sorry about the uh, massive popping noises. I should have taken that into consideration when I realized, yeah, we're doing a late game stream. We should probably not have it bleed people's ears to death. Or have, you know, people's ears bleed out. I guess that's a common courtesy thing. Oh well. I'll remember that for next time. <laughs> Assuming there's a next time. Uh, where, we, where do we want to place this? I know I can fit some Techno Terrors in here. There's gotta be a spot, right? I just can't see it that well. It's kinda hard to make it work. Activate this. Activate this for one quarter speed. I could activate Techno Terrors and Nirvana Clear it all up too. I can't fit any down here. How about it? Yeah, I can. There's one. There's two. Ah, I can keep going on these. Techno Terrors just right on top of the temple. That's neato. Sweet. Here, I don't want this ninja. I want another ninja. Kelm, I mean, you've probably been here for a while, but welcome to the stream. How you doing, man? Life is happy. Sorry, I didn't really notice you until now. I know I should be paying a bit more close attention to the chat, but I'm mainly focusing on how the hell am I going to fit these techno tears in? That's my top priority at this moment. But here. Move this guy over a bit. Move him up. Alright, looks like I can keep fitting him. Oh, I saw something. Oh, perfect. That's nice. Sweet. So the OMGs are getting really strong really fast, and they're getting really fast really fast, meaning we gotta keep up with our Robo Monkeys and Techno Terrors and all that. Yeah, I mean, it gets, it gets pretty tough eventually, not gonna lie. I love how, like, some of the Techno Terrors are just invisible. They're hiding underneath the, the uh, spots of the temple. So cool, you know? Oh, I can fit another guy in here. Don't mind if I do. I'm gonna just activate these since I can. I'm gonna slow these guys down. Just kind of wanted to clear off the screen. There were some balloons getting far for some reason. I guess I need to stall them. Alright, now I see a bunch more spots where I can play Super Monkeys. Sweet, sweet. So right here. Right here. And let's keep them coming. That's my boy. Super Monkeys are boys, right? I mean, it's never, like, explicitly stated. I guess Super Monkey could be female. I don't know, what's your guys' opinions? Male or female Super Monkey? Like, I have a feeling if it's kind of a kid's game, Ninja Q would probably make it more obvious if it was a female super monkey. Still, I mean, it could be. It could be very gender neutral. Sometimes it's hard to tell male and female monkeys apart, I think. At least somewhat. Damn, I keep losing my mouse in the sea of uh, all the towers and blooms and everything. Like, I had track of my mouse, then I'm like, where the hell did it go? And, and I have to, like, refind it. It's kind of annoying. Male, male. Could be hermaphrodite. Could be attack helicopter. Nah, dude, that's what the Apache Dart Ship is for. They are the true attack helicopters. Alright, can we place any of these guys up here? No, but I can place ninjas up here, so I'm actually going to get some sabotage supply on ninjas. Or at least one before I forget. See if there's any more crevices or openings. Nope, alright, back to the super monkey spam. It's pretty good. So let's try over here now. Here seems like a great place for all this. 
Oh jeez, these are getting fast now. Holy crap, I actually wish there was lag so I could have more time to place these guys. I still have not filled the map, and it's round 85. It's ri ridiculous. We also don't have that much money, should be noted. Damn, we're gonna we're gonna run out of money soon. If we can keep this up. Newt newt! Ah, uh, money replenishment, of course. Nah, it's a donation though. From Jacob MX and BO3 Gaming. Thanks so much for a donation, man. A one dollar. Is that Australian? What what kind of currency is that? That just has an A in front of it. A Copernicus. Right, placing these guys. I think that's. Oh, I saw something. I saw. It. Yes, right here. Right. Yep. Fuck you. All right. Got to keep activating that ninja because balloons are actually kind of getting pretty far right now. May have to activate activate some of these uh, techno terror guys. Thin out the crowds. All right. Perfect. See if we can place some more up here. I kind of doubt it. It's not likely, at least. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Another ninja ability we need. Ninja ability kind of wears off after the 15 seconds unless you activate before the balloons come on screen. Which, I mean, I really should be doing, but I'm not. Because I'm too busy building my Techno Terrors. Activate another ninja ability. Once you get it going, I think you want it every 10? 10, 10 seconds, yeah. Alright, did we miss any super monkeys here? Are there are any guys that are only slightly upgraded. Alright, looks good to me. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna carefully, at least, place up here. So we don't accidentally activate that ability. Or the the tower boost. That would be bad. Alright, continuing. Move this off to the side as much as possible. Sweet. All right, activate this. Activate ice. And you know we're not, we're not doing too bad. Round 90 is going to be a really easy accomplishment. We're probably going to have the highest game on Battles TV at least by far. I mean, the highest I've only seen on Battles TV is round 92, 93. Then the players gave up. It was also insane slow mo. This game doesn't have it. We're uh, we're just cutting right to the chase. You feel? Keep it going nice and quick. Activate this, activate ice. Alright, another temp, or another super monkey. Can we fit? Uh, things are looking kind of bad for that corner. That is another Newt Newt, though. Holy be Jesus. Coming at the speed of light. From Jacob MX and BO3 Gaming. Again, thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. Really kind of you to do that. Honestly. All right, where else can we place our super monkeys? Anywhere else up here. I have a feeling this whole top area has been mostly covered. Now we just move down. Yeah, I think so. So I'm gonna get this spot first. And the ZOMG is sped up again. Let's fix that. Ice ability, of course. I still don't know what type of currency it is. Did anyone tell me? I wasn't sure. Oh, in before the replay gets stuck on live and no one can watch it. Well, currently people can watch it, though. I have a feeling it's not going to be glitched. Oh, Jacob and MX with another donation. That's cool. Still don't know what type of currency it is. But hey, I mean, it's definitely appreciated nonetheless. Really cool of you. I'm going to just activate all these, catch these stray balloons, make it far. I don't need none of those. Hell no. I don't want none of that. Not in my house. Alright, here's another Techno Terror. Yeah, Techno Terror seem to have a larger footprint than the Zero Zero Super Monkeys. I don't care though that much. We're being relatively smart about how we're placing it. In the end, I mean, it kind of works out. Okay, let's slow these down again. Give them a half speed. Oh, it's Australian. Okay. I thought it had an AUS in front of it. Oh, and he donates again. Another Newt Newt from Jacob MX. 
or AUD, I guess, for Australian, but I guess it abbreviates to just they. All right, well, confusion averted. It's okay, guys. All right, that one ZLMG is getting kind of far. It's strong. It's going pretty fast, too. Speed racer. Slow the balloons down. That should be that's easy enough. I have this guy on strong. Let's see, are all my front temples on strong enough? Alright, whatever. That's not too important right now. Let's keep placing our techno terrors. Oh, come on. Oh, we could upgrade this dude. My dude. I'm gonna activate these abilities so we can deal with the BFBs. This is a lot of clicking though. Click, 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 click. I'm gonna get tar carpal tunnel just from this stream alone, I swear. Here. And then, can we put one directly above? Oh, we can. Alright, there's some balloons making it kind of far. That's not that, that far yet. Nothing I'm worrying about. So actually... Oh my god, another new dude. Jacob, this is so kind of you, honestly. Dude, seriously. Thank you so much. Alright, we're gonna do one last sweeping check of uh, Super Monkey positions. Because I kind of want to save this bottom box just for selling and rebuying the Mortar ability. Mortar ability is great, yeah. Activate this. Activate the ice. A couple Techno Terrors. Some balloons making it really far on my screen. Let's not fuck that up. So let's see. Can we still fit a mortar in here with these? Eh. Somewhat easy. I'm gonna just have this here for now. I'll make it a mortar stall or artillery battery. So that'll be useful. If we place this here, I suppose. Alright, now we gotta just place all our ninjas, our sabotage supply lines, and our ice abilities. So I'm just gonna place them wherever I see there's an open spot. It's places where our techno terrors cannot fit in. These other guys will, because they have a much smaller footprint. I saw something down here. Maybe I could have been a bit more organized. Hey, people are cheering me on from the street. Obviously. Oh, Jesus. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, because I clearly cannot find abilities. I'm gonna activate this. Activate this. Alright, well, hold on. Thank you for the newt newt. Let's just not fuck this up. Whoopsie daisy. I could not find spots to place the ninjas, so these balloons got really far really fast. Let's just place this again. May need to energy. No, I think we're fine. I'm going to activate all these for safety. Another sabotage. Oh my god. Okay, it's okay. Tyler, you're a prick from Calum. No you. Thanks for the $2 donation regardless. What am I even doing? What am I even doing wrong, man? I didn't realize I was being a total prick. I'll stop if you like. <laughs> nah, but being a prick is fun at times. Alright, I guess I'll have to just keep selling and rebuying Ninja right now. I didn't expect to do this. Maybe I'll sell a Techno Terror and make it possible. So Ninja for sure is important. There we go, we got one up here. Activate this again. Round 96. No real troubles. We almost had a scare. But that's all it was. Just a scare. Okay, let's get this guy to ice ability. There we go. And apparently that one ZOMG did not get ninja'd, which was bizarre. Alright, where can we fit more ninjas? I'm gonna activate my ninja abilities on the 15s. So when this gets 59-15, I'll press a ninja ability. Alright, perfect. Let's go back to placing. Oh, there we go, that's a good spot. Another ice, and I'll activate ice whenever I just damn feel like. You know, when the balloons seem to be getting kind of far. We're about to activate another ninja. All right there. Activate some of these, just to kind of clear things up. I mean, this is kind of what you want to do in Lincoln. You want to use the abilities as much as humanly possible. It's the 
smart thing to do. Slowing that down. I think one of our ZMPs actually didn't get ninjas. ninja So I accidentally sold one of the abilities I didn't use. That's fine. Now we're just going to place everything with ice. Or place ice everywhere, because I think we have max ninjas. Yeah, we can we can sabotage forever. This is good. We cannot ice ability forever right now, though. A lot of these guys are at half speed. Oh, maybe I'll do it every 10 seconds? I don't know. Oh, Newt Newt again from Jacob with the Australian dollar. Surprised he's not attaching any message, but hey, it's appreciated nonetheless. Um, Alright, can't place an ice there. I may need to just sell and rebuy ice. That's fine, right? It's so round 98. We're going to hit 100 pretty soon, which is very cool. What else would be cool would be fitting in ice towers. I know that may be a lot to ask for. There we go. There's another. I'm going to keep activating these uh, Techno Terrors. Just deal more damage. Tao will lose first because he commentated the stream. Nonsense. I got this. I believe in myself. If I learned anything from Dora the Explorer, it's just if you keep believing in yourself, you will win. Oops, let's activate this. Ninja and ice. Oh, uh, Damn, this map is pretty full. I may have to just start mortar stalling. Well, I guess I don't need to right now because the balloons aren't too much a threat. And activate this again. Oh, some of these ZMGs are kind of getting far. Jeez, why are the ZMGs, some of them still going like full speed? That's odd. Maybe they didn't get saboed. Yeah, that was probably the issue. They didn't get saboed. Hate when that happens. It's okay though. Can anybody find me somewhere to place my towers? <laughs> you learned anything from Dora the Explorers that I sab greater than Tyler? Mm, I don't remember that episode. Newt Newt again from Jacob. The man, the myth, the legend, with the chain of one dollars. He's showing up on this stream a lot. We're seeing his uh, little dildo bike nose poke out very frequently. Alright, I'm, I'm still trying to just maybe pull off some ice tower magical placement. We're only 19 rounds off from the record, and to be honest, these OMGs aren't getting that that far. Like, when we're actually doing a good job of defending them, we're doing, we're, we're, we're stopping them. We're putting them to a stop. Keep ice ability. Like, we have quite a few ice towers. So this is good. I'm, unless, I'm, I'm really hoping we don't die. Yeah, no, this is looking good. Oh, Newt Newt again with the, oh, a $2 donation. Stepping it up. Oh, sorry, you guys didn't get to hear a text to speak. Please. said another one, Daddy. I love you. Much love to you, Jacob. Thank you so much for the $2 donation, bringing in that message. Alright, eventually we'll have to start mortar stalling though. It's like a guaranteed thing. Yeah, I think we placed all the ice towers we can place. It's sad, but it's true. I mean, we have a decent amount of ice at you. We're, 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 we're slowing things down overall very well for the most part. And Ninja. God, this combo is so strong, though. It's disgusting in regular battles when you have both Ninja and Ice because you can be so greedy, right? Then all you have to do is activate both abilities, and anytime anyone rushes you, you'll just have all the time in the world to get up a solid D. All the time in the world. Well, those mobs are being a little pesky. I don't mind that. The fast mobs, but I really don't care that much. I don't see myself dying to mobs. Everything goes right. Shoot, I actually can't place this mortar. Hello, mortar. Do I need to sell this guy? I think I do. I want to be extra. I want to just be. It to be extra easy to place a mortar tower. All right. Well, that was still quite difficult. Okay, let's activate more techno terrors. Yep. 
You'd sell for more absolute zeros because you want to spam ice at the start of each round. Interesting. You kind of see where you're coming from. Makes sense, except I just can't seem to find my... I'm just not entirely sure where I'd want to sell. I'm really not sure. I also don't hate, or I also don't like how the ninja ability doesn't really stack. Like if you uh, use a ninja ability and you're waiting for its 15 seconds to be up, and you use another one, well, it's not going to actually work, which is a bit of a shame. Sell this fire mortar. I don't actually need it. ZMGs don't stall that long, do they? Oh, I think I can fit nice here. Yeah, we can. Perfect. I just saw that now. That was a wide open spot. Easy peasy. I keep activating our tech terrors. Activating an ice when we can. I kind of want a ninja. There we go. Activate another ice. Alright, activate this again. Keep- Oh, I saw a spot. I definitely saw a spot. It's kind of weird, because the red and the white look so similar. But we defended that fine. Uh, Spire Mortar back. Around 104, it's gonna be a piece of cake. I don't even know if I want to activate that. All right, this is actually going pretty well right now. Let's let's just like look manually, see if there's anything that may help. What's really nice is the rounds take so long, giving our abilities all the time in the world to come back. We're gonna have Max Techno Terrors ready for next round. They'll be coming at them. I'll activate that right now. In fact, I'll even start on it. Start spamming them ices. Not spamming, but clicking somewhat kind of fast. Activate another one in case I miss the ZOMG somehow. Alright, so round 105. Are these rounds just gonna be all a couple of ZOMGs right now? And have them get progressively stronger? It's kinda interesting, because that's just a really small cluster of ZOMGs. It's not that big. When those pop down the mobs, we're definitely gonna need the spam. And the ice abilities. Activate a few of these as well, maybe a ninja. Man, I've been, I've been looking for ice spots for forever. I think we finally found them all. Don't quote me on that, though. I could be totally wrong. I've been wrong once. It wasn't fun. Would not recommend. Alright, this is a lot of ZOMGs this time around. No real issue, though. Got taken care of pretty well. And actually, the mortar stall is pretty useful. Oh, what the? Some of them didn't get saboed. Does the mortar stall undo the sabo? It's kind of bizarre. Anyways, I had a hard time placing that mortar stall. I'm gonna just kind of keep doing that with time, though. Activate another sabo if I have to. No, I don't think I have to. May want to activate an ice, though. I really don't need a mortar stall that much either. Yeah, it's still not timed. I'm not going to waste my energy. Also, we have three battle energies, which will be super useful when we get to the later rounds. Yeah, just a couple ZOMGs to go. I'm going to activate ice on that. I'm going to save my techno terrors like usual. All right, so actually, no joke, I think I will be able to pay attention to chat more now than I was before. Because I spent so much time trying to place them towers. It was ridiculous. Honestly. I was surprised with how much effort that took. Oh, jeez. Okay, that's, that's a lot of stuff. Keep activating them ices. Come on, mortar. Place. Place, you fucking mortar. Ah, jeez. Oh, Iceab's already coming with his first energy. Ah, does he think uh, some of them went too far, maybe? Here, I'm going to sell this Techno Terror so I can place my mortar better. Ah, right, there we go. This is much better. Activate this ninja ability. Keep activating this mortar. I'll just stall when I can. Uh, that's pretty good. Excellent. 
Uh, now these are down to Moebs, but Moebs, they can be mortar stalled, and plus they're really high on the map still. I just have used an energy, though. I hope he's not struggle lugging on his side. That'd be pretty bad. Because on our side, we're doing pretty good. These, these, this time, the ZOMGs are getting stopped because we're mortar stalling. So that's the difference the mortar stall is going to make. Might as well use an ice ability, too. <laughs> you beat Ice Ab for Koth rules. If only we were playing Koth rules. Then I could claim victory right now. Oh shoot. Some of those EMGs got really far. I'm gonna activate this. Activate another ninja, I think. And kind of keep coming on these guys. Moabs are getting far, but I don't care about that. I'm gonna have to activate another ninja. Oh, that didn't click. Fuck me. Damn. Let's keep mortar stalling, I guess. We can get nine more Techno Terrors if we wanted to as well. And yeah, because I, some of the ZOMGs were on the screen when I activated the ability, meaning I have to use the ninja ability frequently now. It's fine though. Activate this. Oh, some of those ZOMGs are really getting far. Okay, it's down to BFBs now. I'm a little bit feeling better about this. Slightly. I activate the ice, those mobs don't dart across the screen. Pretty good, keep activating that. Yeah, okay, more, more stall setups, pretty good here. Some ZOMGs still made it pretty far though. Activate this, activate this. And Techno Terrors are gonna help out a lot. I can still use Battle Energy if I have to, and Battle Energy will definitely save my butt. Keep activating this. Do I Battle Energy here? Yes or no? I think I can get away with not. Yeah, I think I can get away with not battle energy. Yes, we did it! Got away with not battle energy. That is great. Round 109. Fight continues. It's a shame the music doesn't get more epic for late rounds, because honestly, this is legitimately intense. I don't usually like watching late game or doing late game with just random stuff. But if you're doing try hard, try to get the highest round ever late game, it's pretty intense because there's a lot that goes into it. A lot of selling and rebuying abilities. Oh, road spikes. <laughs> Good call. Yeah, I could do that. That'd be kind of funny. I'm gonna activate one of these. Seven of these. One of these. Gotta keep stalling. Oh, that's still a lot of ZOMGs, I think. We got a lot of these guys back. I activate one of these. Now, let's see if we can go without activating a battle energy again. I'm optimistic. BFBs are getting pretty far. No ZOMGs left. I think that's huge. Oh, shoot. Activate this. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna energy here. I think I have to. I don't know if I had to, but I needed to. I feel like I needed to. It was my destiny. Alright, these ZOMGs are fast now. There are some fast fuckers. I think I missed them with the ice ability too, so that's gonna be kinda hard. Oh shoot, I shouldn't have used the ice ability already. That was a waste. Activate this. Seven of these. They'll do the most damage when the ZOMGs are in the middle of the map. We are at round 110. We would be very close to breaking the original titles record. If that, you know, right now, we would be, but this isn't the original title. We have to beat round 119, so I'm definitely a little worried. We're down one battle energy, and there's still ZOMGs on the screen. Gotta, gotta get my ninja ability back if possible, or keep mortar stalling, So we're doing a lot of all this. Get ninja ability, get that mortar stall up. Seven of these. I said coming in. He's got another battle energy. I think we can defend this without battle energy. Yeah, this round is long. Yeah, we can mortar stall defend, I think. Oh yeah, I can, I can still road spike. All right, didn't need to. It's okay, it's okay, boys. Let's, let's just use our road spikes right now. I don't want to think about those. I don't even want to think about it. Sorry to change a record for you. It's all good. 
We actually would hit it right now. We hit our original goal of round 111. That's pretty good. But the fight is definitely not over. It's not even close to over. We still got eight more grueling rounds. And each of them are going to take so freaking long. Oh, I wasted a nice ability. Whoops. It's okay. Looms are getting really far now. May potentially want to battle energy. I'm not sure yet. Uh, I think I've got it. I think I've got this. Oh, shoot. I gotta click away real quick. Also want to upgrade this guy. Stall and hope we don't die. Alright. Hopefully we don't lose the ceramics. If we lose the ceramics, I wouldn't see it coming, which would be genuinely awful. I think we're okay for now. Round 112. Activate all these. No, ISAB! Oh, man. ISAB. Dude, I wasn't even close to dying. No. <laughs> boo. Boo, ISAB, boo. You whore. We were destroying it. I, I definitely could have actually lasted until round 119. Like, I was still beating most of those rounds without battle energy. Oh, no, was it? What was it? <laughs> Rip in pepperonis. Alright, let's rematch. You're bad. <laughs> What'd you lose to? Volabs or VFBs or ceramics or ZOMGs or what? No! We were almost there, guys. <laughs> Tyler is hacking. Yeah, I, I thought I'd do really good for that. I also realized my recording stopped halfway through there. We can do this on practice mode. Oh, no, we can't. You don't have enough money to do it. Uh, does anyone does anyone want to send me a data jot, dot jet file with a modded practice mode? Because if ISAB wants to leave, I want to do it myself. Damn, we were so close. So close yet so far, and then ISAB dies. Who's the person who said Tyler was going to die first because of uh, he's live streaming? Yeah, you can go fuck yourself. Kindly, of course, in a gentle way. That was the Moebs. Maybe Isab wasn't making the best use of his abilities. I'm not sure. Because, I mean, we had pretty much the same defense. Maybe he had less Techno Terrors. Oh, maybe he didn't put his Techno Terrors on strong. Putting Techno Terrors on strong is also pretty important. Oh, man. Yeah, if anyone wants to, like, send me via Twitter or Discord, modadea.jet, I'll do it uh, again. Because Isab seems to be a... Party pooper who doesn't want to play again. The only way to go for the record by myself is to do it on defend mode, right? But defend mode has an income cap, so you're actually you don't get that much money. You won't get enough money to completely fill the map. So I think we can do it. They were on strong. Damn, how did you die and I not then? It's a shame. Alright, since he's not doing a rematch, I want to back out, see how many thumbs up on Bell's TV it got. Did you guys do your bidding? Trending. Oh, holy shit, already. <laughs> 110 thumbs up for 185 views. That is dope. Highest round on Battles TV. This is also the highest two-person game. So, I mean, having to rely on a partner as a clutch, so that's kind of cool. That was actually really intense, though. <laughs> we could watch the replay. I wish it was like eight times speed so we could jump to the end. 
and see if uh, th this shows how ISAP died. Maybe he has had less abilities than me. We can just watch it in the meantime while I wait for the data.jet. There we go. We can watch and critique what we did wrong. Fuck it, call it a record, get the views. <laughs> uh, I will be trying this again, but I'll be doing it solo because ISAP wants to bail. Just so you know, if I um end up breaking around 119 or hitting one round 19 on practice mode, I'm not including you in my video. I'll include it like a, in the bloopers. Is anyone sending did that jet? Uh, it looks like Autismo might be, although he hasn't done it yet. I don't care if I get like 20 billion data dot jets though. I mean, all I need is to use one. All right, so this was our game, right? I actually have more eco than I have. That, that's that's why I won. I had more eco. Tyler hacking. So, not gonna lie, I really like the mortar in that. The mortar stalled more than I thought. Like, I know mortar stall goes down as the game goes on. Like, it stalls balloons for less long. But it still stalled them for a decent amount of time. That was legit. Actually a really useful tower. Ah, uh, we're still waiting on the files. Nothing, nothing. Le replay already looks legit with those leaks. Yeah, it looks like we should be dead by now with the amount of lives we've lost. Tyler, would you send Camel Reader Reds? No, I couldn't. If, if I did, it would have killed him. And I didn't want to kill, I said. That's rude. Coat's rude. I do appreciate him, for, appreciate him for staying along with me, though. Made for a more entertaining game, I think, than just practice mode. But I believe we can get it. I, I know we can get it. I'm sure of it. I mean, this, this, we're not going to actually watch the whole thing, it's just kind of serving as background thing. So you guys can watch something while I look for the files, otherwise you just have to look at the boring old battle screen. Because generally when I do a live stream like this, I kind of like to hit my goals. Balloon circles is longer but less space. Yeah, less space, that's the reason I don't do it. Um, first off because of the water, and second because it's curved path. Meaning there's some like really tight spaces in the center where it's kind of hard to fit towers and like the windmill and the scarecrow kind of make it hard. I honestly, I genuinely think this map is better for late game than balloon circles. Like it's close. Maybe it takes a while for the file to send over. It's not that big. It's like a large file. The game didn't slow down, by the way, when it was lagging. Oh, was it lagging for you, Isaac? Oh, that's why he was lost. He lost. Yeah, you see, I had zero lag on my side whatsoever. None of it. I guess Isaac lagged, so, oh well. Anyways, we have the data.jet. Let's do this. Download. I'm gonna take care of this real quick. Uh, we're gonna go to battles modded folder. I'm just gonna save this for future reference. Ah, just leave it like that for now. Then we go to PC, overdrive C, program files, Steam, Steam apps, common, Blue Sea Battles, assets, paste, and replace file. Alright! Awesome, we got what we needed. Let's get ready for round two. I'm gonna thumbs this up and uh, quit out of the game real quick. I, got, I have to reload the game to make this work. So give me a second. Okay, there we go, loading it back up. So now, how this works is that we just have to go into practice, practice mode and we're gonna have single player hashtag epic late game. And I think it's gonna work. I don't know how much money he started me off with. So let's do it. We go to Blue Antonio Mines. Same old map. Use only three road spikes, not five, otherwise it wouldn't be legit. Shit. Alright, so Super Monkey. Ice Ninja. And now we wait until Mortar. We wait until Mortar. We wait until Mortar. 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 Bomb is... No, it's not as good as Mortar. It definitely isn't. 
Village actually may be a useful tower, but I'm not using it. I may at some point. Mortar. 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 Oh, sniper could have been useful. Mortar. Mortar. We've gotten the semen shoot like five times already. Mortar. Mortar. <laughs> yes! Don't accidentally click it now. Alright, so. Are we ready for round two? Let's hope it starts me out with... Oh, so, okay, okay. Gotcha, so it's like assault mode. I still have to send the eco. But I won't get eco sent back at me, which is good. So I'm actually gonna stall here. Let these balloons go by, then I'm gonna get my ninja. Because I think ninja's probably a bit more effective than mortar for early game. Yeah, let's place that down right now. Make the rounds last as long as possible. Get ready, boys. Round two. On the quest for round 119. Hey, Iceab, could you... Uh, oh, I get the balloons back still? Oh, lame. Why is it playing with fire? Lame. <laughs> I did not expect that. That's fine. I don't care. I mean, we made it work before. <laughs> this time, uh... We just have to... <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, we just have to be sure to not die round 14. I'm gonna move this down here a bit. I mean, that's fine. So, also the sad part is this doesn't show up on Battles TV. It's a shame, actually. Practice matches totally should show up on Battles TV, but they don't. I guess they're not as interesting. People would rather watch a 1v1 than this. That's fine. Just making sure the mortar doesn't actually miss any balloons. It doesn't look like it does. Yeah, on that bend. Alright, perfect spot. Greens are gonna be a little bit annoying. Can fix that. Upgrade this. Then we'll want Bernie stuff eventually. And we'll go about the same old normal route. So that game took about 75 minutes. A lot quicker than I thought, especially I guess since there was no lag. That helped out a lot. Thank you, no lag gods. I appreciate it. Really appreciate it. All right, so now we cross our fingers. We don't die to green balloons. Can we do it? Yes, we can. Ah, uh, the builder. Yeah, I'm just gonna, gonna get this guy real quick. Like, I obviously was not supposed to buy the ninja. But in my defense, I did not know balloons were coming my way. So we're gonna have ice have tier income right now. AKA bad eco. Very bad eco. Because that's what I said had. Yeah, so I'm hoping we get a bunch of people to come to our channel from that uh, one game. Just saying. Be pretty dope. Is your fingers on, finger on steroids or something? How the fuck can you manual, manually eco? Well, I maybe has something to do with the fact I've played piano for like 14 years of my life. Not that long, but you get the idea. I've played piano for a long time. So I can deal with abusing my fingers. Oh, you know, I'm gonna send greens. I can't, I can't deal with sending yellows. I guess I should get myself an auto clicker though, shouldn't I? Lesson learned for next stream. So, it's too late to download it now. It's too late to apologize. It's too late! Oh. Oh! Just so you know, after this stream, I'm like never doing hashtag epic late game again. That's just how it is. Just join how that around 119 thing work out. Isab died like a little bitch. He and heroed and got himself killed. It was very sad. We got to around 112. I guess he was lagging on his side, which certainly doesn't help. I gotta love though, this this computer has been excellent to me. I was recording in 1080p, I was streaming in 720p, and going hashtag epic late game. Zero lag. Like, I legit had no lag problems. I had placing towers problems, that had nothing to do with computer and everything for me. Tyler's top over incoming rainbows can be sent round 13. Oh shit! Probably prepare for that. Hey, I'm Signals. Scared double shot. That may make it easier.
<laughs> I stab this little bitch. <laughs> true. So true. God, I don't even know why I hang out with that guy. Literally the worst. You would have died before round 119 if you used one boost before round 112. I, th I think I panicked. Like, I didn't need to. Considering I... You know, the, the boost was on, like, what, round 109, 110? And then I didn't need to boost after that. I was like, oh, I'm a bit more confident in my defense now and my mortar stall ability. Like, I think once you get in the rhythm, you can afford to not boost. At least that's my excuse. What's weird is I actually didn't see you die on my side, which is actually really bizarre. On my side, it looked like you survived, so I want to say... Lag may have had more to do with it than we think. Sounds like someone needs a better laptop. Uh-oh, we're down to 146 lives. This may be the end of us. Oh no. I'm gonna save up for Bloom Jitsu, then I'll send pinks. Our ninja's overall doing very, very well though, so I have nothing to actually worry about. Uh, those regrow pinks are kind of annoying. Fuck it, let's get our Bloom Jitsu ASAP. Give me that. Give me that ass. There we go. Let's upgrade this guy too. There we go. That's what I like to see. So I would be honest, is ISAB young? Ask him. ISAB may actually be live streaming eventually. I'm trying to get him a live stream so I can use him to plug my live stream, which would be super cool. But yeah, uh, Isab is close to my age. You can ask him what his actual age is, though, on his stream. Alright, here's the thing, though. If we don't hit it this practice game, then I'm out of here. We're calling a stream, packing up, it'll be a failure. But at least we'll have tried, right? You're welcome for the day of that jet. That was you, thank you so much. I'm gonna die, I appreciate it, because otherwise this part of the stream would not be possible without you. I would be packing it up and going home, which would be very sad. Would not like that. So I guess I could save up for a big one. That's what I did last game. Yeah, I mean, I might as well. I'll be able to get it in two income boost. I'll be able to get it in one income boost. Holy crap, then I'll have like $7 to spare. That's pretty legit. Look at that, seven freaking dollars. That was like perfect math. Type one for 24 hour stream? Nah, nah, nah. If you guys actually want a 24 hour stream, someone would legit have to pull a Jimmy Jammer. Because, I mean, I don't think I'd do that out of the kindness of my heart. Val's gets tiring eventually. When BTD6 comes out, I could do a 24-hour stream. That would be fun. Damn clicking lead sounds. Clinking lead sounds. Oh, what? Oh, my God. Look at this bullshit, guys. We can't even play this game because this isn't the right data of that jet. We can't get more eco! Oh my god! <laughs> I wanted a facepalm emote myself. Alright. Okay. I hate to disappoint you guys, but <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to do this no more. Because <laughs> here's the thing, right? With 3000 eco, you, don't, you simply do not get enough money to fill the screen with all the defense you need. You don't. So, I, I gotta quit out of this game. Oh my god. You still have that thing of defend mode in there. The oh man. Alright. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that was just that was just dumb. <laughs> Yo, everyone go thumb up, thumbs up this game. We want this to the top of uh top of trending the top of popular. <laughs> oh man. Not like this. Go thumb up this game too, because this game was just dumb. Died on round 14. Uh, God, I don't even know if I want to continue. It's just when he fails so many times, you just get discouraged, you know? That, I mean, that wasn't even like a fail on, it wasn't even a my bad fail, it was just a stupid. <laughs> what was that? Mm. 
Uh, hold on, I'm gonna load up my. Trying again or giving up? I may be giving up. It's very sad. I mean, I can still make a video about round 112. It's pretty good. Ah, oh my gosh. Unless someone gets me like the new or fixed data dot jet like right now, I'll probably just call it an end. Cause here's the thing, I mean, I'll be streaming tomorrow. It's not like I'm done for streaming. <laughs> Dude just messaged me on Discord. Shit! <laughs> what round did he get to? He got to round 112 before I said died. And we're trying to go for it alone, but we're, we're getting, we're getting trolled, man. Getting trolled. Let's reopen battles again. Look at my wonderful background. Should I get a picture of a naked girl for my background? Is that what all dude bros do? Ah. Uh. Yeah, let's see. Maybe I could do this another time. Let's see. <laughs> yes, get a naked girl. Alright, we're getting a data dot jet from Judge and Josh. I'll trust him because I think he used it before. Let's see. Sets. Open this. Downloads. So give me a moment, just get this set up. Set up. So this, and then asset, so I'll paste this back in here. All right, whoops, gotta reload the game, what am I doing? So this will likely work. If it doesn't, I won't know what to say. I'll be shocked. I'll be genuinely surprised if it's done work. Oh, get an auto clicker. Ooh, that's a good idea, actually. Auto clicker. Nice thinking. All right, I'll click her download. Let's see how to use this thing. Auto click her dot virus dot exe. Seems legit. Yeah, I'm actually, I'm, I'm totally gonna get that for this game. Although there's a chance this, um, the file Josh sent me has uh, just infinite money. If it is infinite money starting out, then I have no reason to auto click. Josh, how much money do I start off with? Oh, we gotta go through this bullshit again. Mortar. 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 Why does it hate me? <laughs> God.
I swear, we've had glue and boomerang so many times. So the game really wants us to use glue. <laughs> More starting money is a good advantage. It really doesn't matter. Alright, we got this. Alright, not sorry, just play with fire. Alright, let's get this auto clicker then. I want to run it as well. So every 100 milliseconds. So F6 to start and stop. I think I'll have it do every 50 milliseconds. Okay. All right, <laughs> you're ready. Three, two, one, late game. We got the auto clicker now. So we're gonna get our mortar and we're gonna do this right. I'm gonna miss one. Nope. So F6. Ah, it works. It works, boys. We don't have to do that click, click, click anymore. Alt F4 for infinite money, Tyler. I'm not falling for that. <laughs> he skipped wizard unsub. All right, what about if you're like massively clicking? All right, I, I should probably unclick for that. All right, getting used to this will be kind of tough, but I'll be fine, I think. So weird. Just okay, we got our auto, cl auto clicker up. I'm gonna wait for approximately the time next round's gonna start. Should be soon. The mouse looks so weird. It's like vibrating now that I have the auto click on. That's a lot of lives. Oh, fuck! Why do I have this many lives? <laughs> Holy shit. All right, well, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to Here, I'm going to I'm going to leak intentionally leak myself some lives. What the What is <laughs> What is everything? All right. So my life total is currently a bit over a million. Oh, Tyler, how'd you get the auto clicker? I googled auto clicker and downloaded it. So I'm going to try to peck off some lives so we actually have have it a bit more fair. Why do we have this many lives? <laughs> what the shit? Uh, I love how we just realized this. Watch it actually just be a visual glitch. And when we- And we'll just lose eventually. I would feel so cheated. I'm gonna sell this guy too. I don't need him. Whoops. Now we're sending greens. Okay, good. It isn't just a visual glitch. Oh, if it's a blow. A million is, if, as, is as if you lose. Nah, man. It's too late now. I've already gone down. We're gonna drop ourselves to hopefully like a thousand lives. A thousand lives is a good amount because... Well, realistically, if a Moab goes through, you're dead. <laughs> oh, this <is> bullshit. <laughs> I actually- I'm, how long do you guys think it'll take until it hits zero? Or, you know, about a thousand. That'll be legit. Of course, I also have to make sure I don't just completely derp out and when attempting to stop at maybe 200 or so lives, I die. That would be pretty bad. Around 50 at least. I feel like it's going to take a long while. But we've already dropped like 2,000 just by sending greens. When we send yellows and, uh, whoops, I accidentally sent some blacks. We said yellows and pinks, it's gonna be even, uh, <laughs> it's gonna be even quicker. You're killing yourself. What? Me? No, totally not. No. I'm trying to get to the appropriate amount of lives. Yes, I should have stuck with 1 million and 150, but it's too late now. <laughs> this is kind of funny, actually. Alright, so what's my game plan for making sure I don't kill myself this way? Because that would be incredibly stupid. Whoops, I sent blues and greens. That's fine. I don't really care about that. So when I get to like 2,000 lies, I think I'll start being careful. Cautious. Right now, I don't have to. 
It's a lot of lives to go, though. I mean, we've barely done 5,000. And we're already at... 1k eco. And climbing. Has the attempt been made yet? Well, this is my first solo attempt. We're trying it. We're gonna hope it goes well. I believe. I Seb and I got to round 112 together. And I'll probably make a video about that. But this, if we do even better, then we'll celebrate. Enjoy free regen rainbows. Wait, really? Oh, I guess I can't see right now, but that's pretty legit. Is your auto clicker called OP auto clicker? I don't know, man. It was the first Google result for auto clicker. It seemed trustworthy and didn't have a virus. That's really all I care about. Buy a nice tower and prep for Arctic Wind. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. It's probably a good idea. And we'll have the in income to pretty much instantly buy it at that point. Let's see, so each blob of pinks costs us about 300 lives right now, and it's growing. Yeah, 250, 300. Tyler's a hacker confirmed. Oh no, I didn't get to hashtag epic late game legit. I had to hack. Why are you modding when you're going for the world record? Well, if I want to play solo, I have to mod. There's no way around it. Because there's no solo mod that, or solo mode that gives you enough money to constantly defend. I wanted to do with ISAP, but uh, someone sucks. Would this be considered legit? I think so, considering the fact that ISAP, I, I mean, the early game is easy. It, it really is. It, you get the hang of it pretty quickly. And once you get past the early game, it doesn't matter. I don't know, like how do I explain this, right? Because, the fact that I have a bit more eco now is not going to stop me from being able to place a crap ton of towers late game. Like, last time, I got 10,000 eco and I was set. I could fill my screen just on that alone. That's all I needed. So the same applies here. I'll stop at 10,000 eco and it'll be legit. You know what's actually pretty funny? I7 and I were really close to our previous world record. Back when Chipper was still super strong, I7 and I went for a world record and we hit around 115. But to be fair, we were using a clearly inferior loadout, but we had the OP Chipper so we could constantly ZLMG suck. And we hit round, yeah, 115. So we were three rounds off of that. This time, without Chipper. That's insane. I mean, of course, we first off used the better map. We had both of the slowing towers. That was huge. Ninja and Ice are essential for late game. Having balloons at 25% speed is so important. It's huge. It's without a doubt the most important thing. And what do we have? We had like Super Monkey, Ice, Balloon Chipper, and Sniper. And I think Mortar and Sniper are close to the same as far as power goes. So. It's honestly insane that we've only lost like 22,000 lives so far. This is gonna take forever! We may have to leak like full mobs and BFBs just to be able to <laughs> get close to a reasonable life amount. Start sending zebras? Nah, I get eco slower that way. You know what I might do? I might just get the 10k eco and then keep my life total. Remember what it is and like just calculate what 150 lives blow is. I might just do that. Because even if we keep this up, right? <laughs> It's gonna be so long until we actually hit low lives. Sorry if I donate you 500 euros, would you live stream one game with me? 
I mean, yes, but you also won't donate me 500 euros, so... It's an interesting hypothetical. Send yourselves more evs. <laughs> See what happens. Yeah, we could totally just drop on lives. Let's do this. Just a few fast goal mobs, just five. Nothing major. Whoops. No biggie. We're just gonna, we just ruined our eco a little bit and we're gonna drop down a few lives. No biggie, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. On the quest to 10k eco. Ba da bum bum, bum bum, bum bum. And we're gonna see a decent sized drop here. Plop. Each Moab is about like 600 or so lives. I think it's 616. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good indeed. All right, give it another like few minutes. Then we'll have Max Eco and then the game will start being interesting again. So I may have to pull up my picture where I have my uh, temple set up. No, nah, I think I, I have it memorized. But yeah, once I get 10k, then I'll just start placing super monkeys, get my temples ready. Oh, zero eco loss. I didn't even notice. Gotcha. Modding is weird. Like, I mean, I do know how to mod myself. I think it was just quicker for you guys to send me a data dot jets. So I do appreciate you guys doing that for me. Really kind of y'alls. Just join what happening, why you have so many lives? Ask Josh that. So I'm going for the single player round 119 battles world record, right? And if you do it solo, you kind of have to mod your money. But I guess in this in this uh, game file, the the lives were also modded, unfortunately. How oh, does he have so many lives? He must be pro. Oh, you missed that. I placed like 20 billion uh, heli pilots, drop ships, whatever they're called, on round one. I just farmed lives. What speed do you recommend for auto clicker? Mine's every 50 milliseconds. I think it's a nice, nice healthy medium. Just anything that gets it done. My finger is super thankful for it right now. Like, I mean, it wasn't causing any issues now, but in 60 years, I'll be less likely to have arthritis. Yeah, it's true. I said and I held the, uh, the non-solo record. Highest, um, highest round on Battles TV, which is basically the same thing. That could be a good title, Highest Round on Battles TV. That'd be pretty legit. Because people like, uh, you know, the beginning of our game was much more interesting because we were just making sure we wouldn't die, and that's kind of important. Plus, we were just on normal assault mode, which I think is interesting to a lot of people. Whenever I see people going late game, they'll do like, Boost the Bonanza with fire on, like, Battle Park and bring Wizard or some shit. But I'm like, if you want to go late game, you really don't need to do that. It's very possible to go to late game without having club modes. But the people who are doing it are kind of bad anyways and won't, you know, hit the record. So there is that. But if anything, our video at the top will teach people how to late game in just normal salt mode. Oh, if you put Battles TV in the title, it gets zero views. It is confirmed by ISAB. That's good to know. Damn, titling's hard. You gotta make it enticing and good for, you know, search results, but not clickbait at the same time. Very, very difficult. Hey, Udi's here. Sorry, watch out, you have no lead pot and power. Shit. <laughs> Let's road spike real quick. Well, that did nothing. We're fucked. Alright, uh, we're about at 10k. Almost there, boys. Do I just go over? I was a little bit worried about my money last time. I'll just build and make you a little bit. It's gonna take you three hours to finish this game? Nah, I think it'll take half that time. Last game took only 75 minutes, give or take. Maybe a little bit longer. It was closer to 90, I think. It's like an hour and a half. That's not too bad. After this game... Record or not, though, it's going to be the end of us. End of the stream. Watch that 11 lives save you in the end. <laughs> uh, I... Right. 
Wait. I thought I placed three road spikes. Why do I have two? Ah, whatever. What are you gonna do, do with the eco? Fuck your wife. That's my plan. Alright, so you still have not even lost 100,000 lives. This is ridiculous! A million lives goes a lot longer than I would have thought. Damn. It kind of be fun. I, I kind of want to try some modded game mode where you have maybe 10,000 lives, but you also can send like regal rainbows on round one if you wanted to, and everything below that. You can send out balloons a lot earlier. Now that. I don't know. Some sort of balancing would be needed, some sort of tweaking, but like some sort of some sort of mode where you just hop right into the action, but also have a lot of lives. So you can afford to tank mobs, tank BFPs, maybe even take a Z tank a ZOMG if you want. I don't know. Oh, five in practice. Then how the hell did I use exactly three and not five? What the fuck? That is weird. Okay, whatever. I'm done with the eco. It's been fun. Let's build our ZOMGs. No, sorry, build our temples. So I gotta be very precise with my placement. Get this guy down here. Can I move it over a bit? Nope. That's pixel perfect. And watch slowly as our, we get our lives destroyed by ceramics. Let's go, zero, 00 Super Monkeys. Yeah, we are kind of defending them. Alright, this third one will surely save the day. Move it down a little bit. Alright, here seems okay. Let's get this guy up here then. And move him over to the side. Perfect. Uh, shoot, where else did I have him? I think here, somewhere, right? Move it down a bit. Move it over a bit. Hey, these zero, 00 Super Monkeys are starting to do work. Let's go, Super Monkeys. All right, plop this guy up here then. Good thing there's no regrows. Regrows would actually kill me a lot faster because the Super Monkeys would kind of slightly pop the regrows, then they'd regrow into five times as many balloons as I had in the first place. Not fun. Get this. Perfect. This guy up here. Do I consider moving him down at all so I can place my mortars better? Oh no, not the camo metals! Oh god, they're gonna ruin me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I need two more temples. And we'll get this here. Jesus, we are losing so many lives. All right, perfect, Super Monkey, and let's hope we can get this without overlapping all the others. Newt, newt. Holy shit, Jimmy Jammer! <laughs> wow, I didn't even know you watched my stuff. A hundred dollars from you. Holy crap, so how much was it for a 24 hour stream? Uh, what did I say before? 500? Oh god, let's uh, let's not die here, hold on. Let's, <laughs> let's, this, this actually could potentially kill us, so I'm gonna get me a sun god down here. I mean, I said 500 before. I think that's a reasonable, very fair amount. I... Yeah, I mean, I might as well hold up to that. Oh, God, I'd have to pop out the Red Bull. I mean, I, that could be fun. I technically don't have plans tonight. One of my friends is at a music festival, so I won't be able to deal with do stuff with him. Another friend's at... A few other friends are at work. But holy crap, even the $100 do donation is so kind of you, man means a lot. Let's triple check. I think this is Gucci. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna replace it. It kind of gets annoying. So once I get up my max defense, then I'll count my lives. Because right now we're still leaking a lot. <laughs> Jesus, what is this? It wouldn't kill you? Well, there's a lot of regrows, okay? I was scared. I was worried and panicking because of it. 
There's a lot of balloons. What do we what do we upgrade first? Let's get this temple first, I think. Yeah, I'll start with this boy. It's so one mortar. Ah ah ah. Two mortar towers. Ah ah ah. Three. <laughs> uh. All right, perfect. This is great. Round 32, don't pull a shaft. Yeah, that sounds like a Tyler thing to do. God, I still cannot get over the fact that we died on round 14 this stream. That is just that is just hilarious. Going for the latest round ever dies on round 14. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, this is pretty much what we want. Get our big ones. Alright, so now that we got our first temple, I don't think we're gonna... Oh shit, we actually... Okay, we actually lost the super monkey. Damn, I fucked up my positioning a bit. It's fine. Can just... Move this guy, like, here. That's not middle pixel. Is this middle pixel though? I think not. All right, hold on, give me a moment. I just want to turn on the lights in my room. It's getting dark in here. I got a decent amount of natural light, but even that's not good enough. All right, so we got a temple. I'm gonna jot down my lives right now so I don't accidentally screw up. So nine, zero, three, five, nine, six, minus 150. I mean, that's simple math. So then we have nine, zero, three, four, Four, six. If we get to that live total or below, we lose. If we get to that. I don't think we will. Like, that would be impressive if we do. But I don't think we will. I'm gonna, act, I'm gonna upgrade this Super Monkey next. Because I'm still worried about whether that temple gets sacked. You know, the temple in the middle. A little sketchy, bro. Uh, is this guy in range? It looks like it is. Bro, song request? Callum, just link a song, I'll play it. I'll totally play it, I mean, why not? Sweet, we got us a ninja monkey. What am I thinking, though? So, last turn we had a lot of place- or last game we had a buttload of placing problems. This time, I think it seems to be going a bit better. Again, I'm going to probably do all the hard temples first. Get this. Now we're going for that temple. Please don't sacrifice the guy in the middle. Yeah! Alright, this is good. Alright, count with the song quest. Time to completely get rid of the admin on the stream, but it's not like it matters. Let's see, what song? Oh, it's a song by Anacondas. Oh, this is hilarious because my old username used to be Anacondas. How many subscribers do they have? Oh, they have 80,000 subscribers. For a while, I had more subs than them. Well, I can make them a bit louder, though. It's on max. Hopefully you guys can hear it, but, uh... <laughs> yeah, they're the worst anacondas. They're not the true anacondas. Yep, you feel? You dig? I like the remix with the balloon popping sounds. Oh, you didn't upgrade the mortars? Fucking hell. I didn't, that's right. Alright, good catch, boys. It's okay, we can replace this. It's okay. I guess I should have muted popping. The song's pretty legit, though. Like, the band Anaconda's legit is not that terrible. It's like Russian rap. My favorite kind of rap. Alright, we didn't fuck up this time. Good. 
turn the game volume down? There's no way to do that. I wish I could. It's very sad. I, I honestly don't know why Ninja Kiwi won't let me turn down the game volume whilst in game. Oh well, I guess. Uh, let's get this temple now. Come on. There we go. Temple number three, easy. Alright. Oh, dude, we lost our super monkey down here. I didn't even notice this. Probably fix that, though. And here comes the ZLMG. Ah, oh, boy. Alright, I'm going to do this guy next, because I may have fucked up my ZOMG thing. What the fuck are you doing? What the fuck are you doing, Chris? Welcome to the stream, Chris OP IMO. We're going for hashtag epic late game. We're doing it once, getting it out of our system, so we don't have to do too many late game games in the future. And so when people ask, Tyler, why won't you do late game? I'll be like, I did late game once. Never again. Who the fuck donates a hundred dollars to this scrub? I oh, don't know, don't ask me. I mean, if Jimmy wants a song request, since I gave one to Callum's two dollar donation. <laughs> oh man. Alright, how many temples do you think we're gonna sacrifice to this temple? I'm thinking all of them. Oh no. Oh, we sacrificed both the bottom bitches now. Are you kidding me? How do we mess up this badly? So this was actually the bottom most pixel too. Shoot, I think I'm gonna re have to refix my temples. God. We're doing so well. Alright, so this is actually legit gonna be really hard. I think I need to sell that temple. Yeah, I need to sell this temple. I think I need to sell this temple, too. Okay, let's just try it again. Alright, it's not in the middle pixel of the rightmost one. Very close. The left one, I think it is. I think this guy will be sacrificed. This guy shouldn't be, though. Yeah, he likely won't. So I'm okay with this being sacrificed, because I was just going to sell it anyways. So let's get our mortars back. Damn, I was doing so well with the ZOMGs last time around. What changed? Or sorry, the temples last time around. Bum, bum, ba -da -bum. Yeah, okay, exactly what I thought. All right, this is much better. Sweet, so let's get this guy here. Now we can actually place him in a safer spot. Like, this is super safe. Definitely not covering any of the center pixels of any of the temples. So I'm okay with playing it safe. Yeah, let's just get a ninja ability, slow things down. These temples are not doing as much damage as I would like. Upgrade my mortars, right? Please tell me upgrade my mortars. I got these guys. Just do the bottom one first. I mean, technically it doesn't matter. I think it's easier for me to uh, avoid the center pixel, or know what the center pixel of a super monkey is than a temple. Although I, got, I admit, it's pretty close. Alright, no one's saying you uh, didn't upgrade the mortars. Thank you, Lord. Uh, let's get a Techno Terror. Get a big ones. And this is what we need. Sweet!
And now we got five of them. Nope, just kidding. We have four temples. Thought we had more. All right, what's our next temple spot? I'm thinking I want this one right here. This spot. Oh no, I actually want the I want the top corner. Top corner was actually a really annoying one last time to try to fit everything in. So we're gonna do that. We're on a mission. Place this here. Drag off. Target. Oh shoot. No, let's just upgrade it first. I have to upgrade my mortars first. Go for perfect placement here. And mortar number three. I said mortar number three. I saw it. Saw it. Yes, yes. There we go. That's okay. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, so I gotta admit, do doing this whole setup thing again is <laughs> genuinely exhausting. It's like, I did it once already. Just let me get to the late rounds. But it's fine. We'll be there shortly, boys and girls. I guess we could talk about the history of late game. Has that, did anyone see a, a Reckless live stream where he hit round 333? Like, did anyone see it live? Because that at the time was legendary as hell. He did on a site called Camcord, which was just like this Twitch wannabe except for mobile games. That was the whole premise of the site. And also had like Nazi admins, but I, I don't need to talk about that too much, right? Anyways, he, he did it on that site and his, his game lasted about four hours to get to round 333. It was crazy. Like it was just a coincidence that he died on that round too. Like he didn't, he didn't give up. He's just like trying his hardest to defend and eventually dies. I think his loadout was the same that I7 and I used when we hit round 115 in the past. It was the Bloon Chipper, obviously, the Super Monkey, obviously, the Ice Tower, and the Sniper. So he used that. And the reason he was able to get so high was because the health ramping and the speed ramping of the mods was not even close to how it is now. It wasn't even close. It was far, 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 far away. Like, I think it was just maybe 5% increase per round. Now it's closer to 40% increase per round. That's how much it changed. I think this this is a good change for late game, though, because, I mean, it still has the same intensity of late game, but it's just, like, doesn't leech off all your time. Yes, we didn't sacrifice that super monkey. Whoop, whoop! He leaked on round 300. Yeah, there was actually a point where the balloons were so fast. Like, he was still chipper stalling, right? And chipper stalling doesn't care about how fast the balloons were going. There was a point where he was... It was going so fast, he would just leak, like, red balloons. He would leak to really fast red balloons and really fast pink balloons. Eventually, he died not by, like, a ZOMG or mob going through, but by red balloons. It was... Something else. Newt Newt! Uh, so let's not die here. Oh, I get it. It's potato backwards. And upside down. What the? How do you get that upside down? Oh, what oh, what oh. oh, my God. Well, thank you so much for the $4 donation. God, that is noisy. Oh, what oh, what oh, what oh, what oh, what oh. Sounds like a tribal chant to me. So I'll answer my question. What's a moderator? I don't know. Someone who sucks dicks for a living, I bet. Oh, I gotta place a... I gotta get my miscellaneous sacrifice in here. And now we'll get this temple. Please do not sacrifice another temple. I don't know why it would. There's no reason for it to. Yeah, okay, perfect. Alright, four more temples to go. Let's do this guy next. He's a little suspicious. I'm not too sure about his effect on those uh, temples down there, or potential temples down there. We'll get them. If it sacrifices them, then I think we'll have time to actually deal with it. Right, one. Two. And where are you? Third mortar, come on. Three mortars. Let's get another super monkey. I don't think super monkeys are as thick as the mortars. They're still thick regardless, don't get me wrong. G 
just how I like them. Slow this down, upgrade our mortars. Upgrade this Techno Terror and get our next temple. Oh, we lost the dude on the bottom. Oh, are we able to place this guy without sacrificing either of these temples? I think we can. Oh, this is scary close though. I don't know if we actually can. No, I think this is a good spot. This one is really close for the temple on the bottom left. Or near the bottom left. Oh, this is really close. Nice lives, I know, right? It's okay. I I'm just gonna calculate if we lose 50 lives, then we lose the game. Simple as that. Newt, newt. Oh, I did not notice that. When are we getting married? Well, uh, if you want to come to Wisconsin, we can make it tomorrow. Actually, I don't even know what kind of marriage you want. If we get married, Chris, it's going to be a Vegas wedding. All right, I've decided that. You free later this week? Either way, thank you for the $5 donation. Much appreciated. Alright, let's try here. I don't know if it's gonna work. It might sacrifice the temple. We're just gonna... This one's actually gonna be nerve-wracking. I genuinely don't know if we'll sacrifice another temple or not. Let's just get up our towers. Alright, you're down with that? Good, awesome. I will meet you in Vegas then. And then I will blow all my YouTube monies on the slot machines instantly. Alright, any bets if this will sacrifice the temple or not? Here we go. Oh, oh, I sacrificed the wrong temple. Shit, this one's actually harder to fit in, too. Damn it. Yeah! <laughs> oh, why do you have to be like this? It's getting late, too. The rounds are actually getting kind of long, so we gotta, we gotta get up our defense fast. Fuck, how many temples have I sacrificed to each other already? I know the temple demands sacrifice, but to each other, it's not okay. Uh, let's try here. Here actually legit seems doable. Now the question is, does it go over this temple? I'm gonna, I'm gonna follow the lines. No, this spot should be good. God, this is why did why was why did I have it so easy last time? I hardly sacrifice any temple to, temples to each other. Clearly, we're just, we're just getting tired, and because of that, we're doing worse. That must be it. I'm predicting we're going to die on, like, round one <laughs> or something. Something ridiculously short or early. Alright. Don't fail me now. Are you fucking shitting me? No! <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, the humanity! Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Ah. <sighs> Oh shit, we almost died. This is sad. This is... This is really bad. Alright. I guess we can sell three temples? Right, let's try this again. Yeah, rip. It ain't going. Let's try it. 
try this, I guess. I mean, I'm just gonna keep trying until something sticks. We got a lot of money. We got still. We still have a decent amount of time. We're not. This isn't over yet. This is pretty bad. Go on, message me on Skype so we can make ceremony arrangements. All right. Well, see you, Chris. Thanks for coming out this stream. This is frustrating. We may have to do the temp ten temple strategy, which I am not a fan of. But necessary or drastic times call for drastic measures. All right, how's this measure up to this temple? Or these temples? It doesn't get this super monkey. It does not get this one. Does not get this one. It mm, shouldn't get this one. It, I think it will get the temple in the middle though. Huh. Alright, ZOMGs are getting really far at this point, too. I think I'm gonna have to sell some of these temples. Don't need to sell... Yeah, I do need to sell this guy. I need to sell all three of these, actually. Because we need this in the perfect spot at the bottom. This needs to be pixel perfect. I don't know why I decided to budge on that. So now, we're gonna get this guy back up here and not sacrifice temples to it. It's cool. Now what about this guy? All right, this is overall safe. Oh, all right, we're gonna leave some lies, I don't care. Oh, maybe not. All right, cool, we did it without leaking lives. Back to less temples again. The trick is to drag the super monkey on, so you can see clear pixel. Yeah, I guess. Here, let's look right now. Just to be sure. This should be fine, this should be fine. And, oh, this guy actually may not be fine. Well. I may have to actually budge this guy upwards. Let's do it. Upwards and to the side. Or we may leak some lives here. Nope, just kidding. I'm gonna just activate nice ability at this point. See if we leak any lives. Should have gone for 12 tremples. Yep, that would have worked out super well for me, <laughs> as you can tell. I'm sure it would have. Alright, doesn't sacrifice this. Currently, does not sacrifice that. It's really scary close, but it, I believe it does not. Does it sacrifice the middle temple? I'm reading a no. Uh, we, we also have $10 million. So on the bright side, we're not going to run out of money if we keep sacrificing our temples to each other. <gasps> oh, we were so close. We were almost there. We still sacrificed the temple to the left. How did I miss that guy? It's okay. That means we can probably do this. How the hell did we... How the hell did we sacrifice this super monkey? What? Oh, never mind, we didn't. I just had it sold still, I think. I actually didn't buy it back. I'm like, what, are you shitting me? All right, we didn't buy it back yet. That's okay. I'm okay with this. Sell. So, now we gotta place the super monkey, so it's good here and here. Now we just gotta be sure not to sacrifice the central temple. I think I'll move this to the side, make it a little bit better. Got a lot of leeway for that middle temple right now. Alright, perfect. This is where I want. This is miserable. I know, but I think we're finally about to get it. It didn't actually sacrifice it, okay? At least it, at least it didn't sacrifice it. I just didn't place the temple down in the first place. Am I getting the ice ability? Oh, not yet. Soon. Might as well just activate it now. Perfect. Hey, it's okay. You know what? All that matters is that we still didn't lose any lives. 
So, I mean, that's pretty good in the grand scheme of things. So, if we can get this guy without sacrificing any of our temples, we have it for sure. Yes! Oh my gosh, that was a huge pain in the ass. Are you kidding me? We finally did it. We did it. We did it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, even 15 Ooh! Oh my gosh. Guys, you have no idea how relieved I am. That was the stupidest thing I've ever done in battles, honestly. This, this was just the stupidest chain of events. Now I swear if this bottom left temple sacrifices others for some reason, like there's no reason for it to, right? Others didn't sacrifice it, so clearly it won't sacrifice the other temples. You know, let's just let's just make sure we have everything we need. One, two, three mortars, one, two, three ice, techno terror, yep. <laughs> yeah, GG spam indeed. Oh, this is pretty good. Alright. Now we're going to keep activating our ninja at ice while we continue to just finish off our super monkey setup and bring it home. Damn, I can't actually see. You got all your temples up by round 70? That's gotta be a new record. <sighs> oh, we're gonna leak some lives? Maybe not. Clutch temples. Alright, now we got this guy in first. Now we just have one temple to go. After we get this guy out, we're gonna start spamming Techno Terrors and take it to the house. Round 119, here we come, boys and girls. It's gonna be great. Assuming we can actually continue to place our mortars. I didn't realize there'd be so much stuff in the way. Mildly annoying. Ah, let's just activate this real quick. Slow these down. God, we accidentally sold the temple. I remember actually last game we accidentally sold the temple. That was pretty bad. But we haven't done that yet. Damn, where can we fit our super monkey? Maybe we can't. Maybe we can only fit three mortars for some reason. Alright, bring this upwards. Activate this absolute zero. How much for 24 hour stream? Sorry, I just got on late. I said 500 when he donated. God, 24 hour stream was weird. But I think my longest ever stream was was for the second YouTuber Mega Tournament, actually. I think it was a total of eight hours. And surprisingly, I was able to keep up the dialogue all the way through. I was impressed with myself, really. It was... Kind of difficult to just keep talking and talking and talking, but we made it work. But yeah, never had one longer than that. Probably a good thing, too. Alright, perfect. Now yeah, let's keep activating our ninja abilities. And an ice. And we'll upgrade our mortars. Wherever they are. Two. And three. Now we upgrade all of our ices to looks like it. Alright, let's get our last temple. Round 73 finally got all of our temples. Wow, what an accomplishment. It's pretty great. <laughs> uh, Alright, so we're we're actually like halfway through the game right now. So now the hard half comes in. So like the le legitimate hard half where it takes a lot of micro and a lot of smart tower placements. Yada yada yada. You guys know the drill. You guys saw my first game. You understand what it's gonna take to keep this keep keep this uh, game alive. You understand? <gasps> Some of the ices didn't get sacrificed. 
Ha. Ha. No, we didn't get all of our temples. Alright, well, take two. Damn mortars, why are they so thick? Alright, let's try this again. I'm gonna place a super monkey right next to it. I'm just gonna get three ice towers right here. All straight fucking... Just kidding. Not so straight line. Alright, I thought we were done with the temple sacrifice, but no! The game clearly want us to sacrifice more. <laughs> God, late late game makes me so senile. It's an issue, really. All right, we're just gonna be a mortar short. This is actually better than our temples from last time. It is. Like we had multiple temples last time that were under sacrificed. This is okay. I'm okay with this. So we continue. Alright, so placing the super monkeys, I remember, was really annoying last time. So we're, there were a lot to fit in. Okay, let's activate these abilities. We had to do this quite a bit too. Did it not work? I swear like the ice ability didn't work. Yeah, it didn't. What the hell? I saw it. Clicked on the button. Nothing happened. Crazy. Oh, I was able to fit one more super monkey up here last time. Maybe not. Guess not. Oh well. It's fine. No real biggie. I wanted to believe. I really would like to. Maybe? Nah. Alright, so so begins the spamming of the Techno Terrors. Want all these guys on strong so they can target the ZOMGs. Cause really the hardest thing in this game are this you know, just dealing with the late game ZOMGs. I got a few temples on strong too to make this happen. Because once we knock it down the BFBs and mobs, not only do they have significantly less health, but they also get stalled by the mortar stall for so much longer. Which makes it a lot easier for me to defend. We can actually fit a decent amount of temples on top of that. Or, sorry, super monkeys on top of that temple, though. It's pretty good. Keep this on strong. Nice, strong super monkey. Very strong. And activate some abilities. Nine of these, don't mind me. Alright, where's my unupgraded super monkeys? I'm sure there's some in here. Oh, I saw you. I saw you. There you go. Saw this guy, too. Lives are hacked. Don't worry, guys. If I if I realize we'll le if we leak 150 lives at any time after this point, I'll know we have lost. We'll also notice when the life flickers. Generally, if we leak lives at all, we probably won't leak less than 150. But you know, I'm keeping track just in case. I mean, you never know. We may leak 149 lives. That would be crazy. Up, oh, some balloons kind of getting far. Do I need a mortar? No, I don't. I want an ice. Where's my ice? There we go. Keep on our super monkeys. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Ah, oh, where are you? 
So by the way, for those who are w wondering why I don't go leaking on a stream, well, this is incredibly frustrating. So that's why. Oh, also, let's be sure not to press that button accidentally. That would be embarrassing. Here we go. Oh, I saw him. Hey. Oh, Cubbage, you're leaving. Man, thanks for coming out to stream, though. Uh, it's for a channel shout-out. Everyone go check out Cubbage's channel. I don't actually know why I did that, but you should be really thankful I did, because I very rarely give shout-outs. Whatever. Happy uploads, man. I get it. Internet speeds suck. My internet is actually genuinely terrible. I, um... I don't have, like, much freedom with my internet, so I'm stuck with really bad charter internet, right? So I live in an apartment, and it's the apartment that decides it. We have three megabytes per second up, and maybe, like, eight down. It's extremely slow and tough to work with. So that that's why in the past we had terrible uh, quality when live streaming. Now we can stream in 720p, so I'm okay with that. Good old 720p. It's a good number. Let's activate some of these, just for shits and giggles. Alright, we're still placing Super Monkeys, though. At this point, last game, I think we had all our Super Monkeys placed. But it's okay, we're gonna continue on the journey of placing the Super Monkeys. So yeah, basically, I can't stream and upload at the same time, because my internet's so bad. And it sucks, but oh well. I mean, next, or once I move into my next apartment in a couple months, we will likely have better internet. It'll actually be with my computer engineering fraternity. And, you know, we're, we're a bunch of computer nerds, right? If for some reason we have bad internet, people are going to be pissed. So I expect it to be very good internet. Who's the best me member of Dream Theater? Ooh, that's a good question. For those who don't know, they're probably my favorite band of, of all time. I mean, currently, maybe not my favorite band. I listen to other bands more, like uh, Blue Oyster Cult or Rainbow or Buckethead. But out of those members, my favorite member is probably the ex-keyboardist Kevin Moore. He was on their uh, the band for like the original two albums, or you know, two of the earliest albums, Images and Words and Awake. And his melodies and it just his tone and everything was just perfect. I mean, don't get me wrong, Jordan, Jordan Ru Rudess is like an amazing keyboardist. He could play like 20 billion notes per second. But they're not always the best notes. We want the best notes, like Trump. We have the best notes. Everyone tells us they're the best notes. Everyone's jealous of their notes. They come over to try to steal our notes. It's not the same. Oh, I missed the super monkey up here. What's up with that? Keep slowing this down. And let's see where we got. Get, we can get more technical terror somewhere. Here we are. I also have a uh, preference to keyboard players in general because, I mean, I played piano for. Okay, so let me actually calculate this. I started in second grade and I'm in basically 14th grade, so 12 years. That's honestly insane. I was uh, trained classically and did that for maybe six or seven years, but never really ended up liking it. There were just so many songs we had to play that I just didn't enjoy. I didn't like practicing them, I didn't like putting effort into songs I didn't like. I also didn't like the rhythm drill, so eventually I quit my lessons and just wanted to do stuff or piano stuff on my own, which I did for a while. Then in high school I joined jazz band, which I enjoyed a lot. It helped that my jazz teacher was super cool, super funny. He would oft often throw drumsticks at people and, uh, you know, give us uh, funny ways to learn rhythms. He was just an overall great guy, right? 
So that helped me start to love jazz and love playing jazz. So I did that for four years in high school. Then after that, once I got into college, I haven't had too much access to a piano. I've In my freshman year, there was one in the dorm that I lived in, which is super convenient. But now I don't live in a dorm, I live in an apartment. With the nearest piano being maybe like half a mile away. Plus I have to like talk to the right people to get in. Like usually, I just ask a friend with a lock picking set to break me into the piano practice room and I play piano. It's generally how it goes. No harm done. All I'm doing is practicing piano. It's not like I'm stealing anything. It's not like I'm vandalizing. It's not like I'm going into the building at um, closed hours. I'm just <laughs> going into the piano room. So I do that from time to time and I just learn songs that I choose to learn. Like right, right now I'm learning Flower Dance by DJ Okawari. Oh, that's such a good song. I bet half of you have actually heard it. It's a really good song classic. Oh, I swear I could fit a super monkey somewhere in here. Yes! That's my boy. Can't donate because it doesn't support it in my country? Did you try the link in the description? There's a super chat and a link in the description. If neither worked, well then I'm so sorry. But otherwise, I mean, donating isn't everything. It's not like the biggest deal. It does obviously help pay with rent <laughs> or pay for rent, but it's not like you have to donate for you know to enjoy the stream. Seriously, I'm pretty sure Super John Bama says the same thing, and it's true. Because here's the thing, right? We as YouTubers cannot in any way expect donations. We can't expect views. We can't expect donations because if we do, at some point we will just be disappointed. So the reason we would have to. You okay with donations? Because, like, we don't really mind that much. Also, we ran out of money. What the? What in the hell in the fuck? Wow. I did not expect that. No, but yeah. We, obviously, we wouldn't want to get disappointed. That would be genuinely bad. Because, uh, wait, you know, a few months ago, I used to get something like 30,000, 50,000 views for video. And now I get closer to 10,000. And I have to realize that the only reason it's happening is because Balloons as a game is kind of fading out of popularity. I can't be like down on myself or like pissed off about that. Because that's how I get upset and stop doing YouTube. It's not great. Anyways, I think we got most of the Techno Terrors we need. This will just be my mortar spot. Alright, can we fit any more of these guys? I'll kind of just hover it around, see if there's anything. Oh, we can. I saw that. Ah, uh, I'm actually gonna sell this because I still don't have enough ice towers yet. I gotta start activating my abilities because we're reaching close to round 90. This is when the game gets starts getting pretty interesting. We filled our screen with the techno terrors and the temples, so we got most of our raw popping. All right, pretty raw. But now, now we get the other things like the ice towers and the ninjas, so we can slow everything down permanently. We want it constantly half speed. I'm just gonna activate a bunch of these. Lots more ice this time. I never found myself short of ice towers last time, though. I thought I had a good amount. Like, maybe it came out to something like 10 or 15. Like, it was a good amount of ice. So now we do this thing where we try to find any spot we can fit a ninja. Activate this. Activate this ice. And here we go. A couple more ninjas. I think we can... We want two more ninjas? I wasn't actually counting how many we have. Three or four or five. Here's another. I'm gonna activate this again. See if we can fit one down here. We can. I think that's enough for ninjas. So now we go for ice. Let's just activate this here. Why not? I know that's my mortar stall spot, but really, I, I can use that for now. Now we find every ice spot we can. Oh, I saw one. I... Where was it? Where did you go? Oh, there. Oh, that was actually a pretty big spa open space. I'm gonna see if I can fit two there. Maybe two. Two is a good amount. Uh, it does not look like I can fit two in there. Unfortunate. Alright, more ice then. I require more ice towers. 
can fit a couple up here, actually. There's, it's kind of sneaky. It looks like at the top of the map, you won't be able to fit any. But you can barely fit it underneath the life spar. It's pretty useful. Let's just clear this up. I actually want the... I kind of want to have the map clear so I can maybe see if there's any more potential ice spots. Damn it, stop sending balloons my way. I want to place my ice. Oh, there's... Oh, there's plenty up here. Hell, maybe I could even fit... No, I can't. Like, maybe I can fit another Techno Terror. Nope, just kidding. Useless. Yeah, I can actually fit a bunch of ice towers up here right now. So have you done it yet? We're on our way. This might be the game. I'm actually really confident about this uh, setup now. Now that we have our, <laughs> finally have our 11 temples and all the techno terrors we can possibly need, now we're just spamming our ISIS, spamming our ninjas, and eventually I'll be selling and rebuying mortar. We are going to be set. I swore I could. Yeah, there it is. The balloon sprite sheet decal was dumb. I agree. <laughs> I don't know how Ninja Kiwi uh, managed to screw that up. Is that still a glitch, by the way? Is there still a blue balloon decal sprite sheet? This would be hilarious if they still had not fixed that. Could I see a spot? Mm, maybe I'm hallucinating. The not able to place towers and the yes you can place towers looks oddly similar. Oh, there we go. Oh, this might be enough for multiple ices. Oh wow, we got a huge area. Oh, look at this. Slow these down, slow these down. Sweet. All right, where, where did I place it? Come on. I don't care about those balloons getting that much far. I mean, we got we got so much temples and just so much firepower in general, we'll defend that pretty easily. I think I can get an ice tower here. It's not going to get in the way too much of the mortar. It's still a thing I saw today. That is just ridiculous. Big clap to Ninja Kiwi <laughs> uh, for giving us this amazing balloon decal that looks like the sprite sheet. It's so good. Yes, another ice spot. Makes me so happy when I finally just see yet another ice spot. We have a decent amount of ices. More than last game, even. So maybe this means we'll defend further? Oh, wouldn't that be cool? I mean, round 94 already, and this is pretty easy. I mean, we'll definitely hit round 110 for sure, and then after that, it'll be a hell of a challenge. Why, do you have, why does he have so many lives? I should like include that in my description or something. It's because I used the modded data.jet. I know, it's very sad. But it was my only way to actually hit a high round by myself. It doesn't matter how many lives I have. Because the second I dropped to 903,446 lives, game's over. Oh, I saw a spot. There we go. Some balloons are getting kind of far, but that's just because I wasn't using my abilities. Nothing to worry about. No problemo here. Not one bit. Oh, I had a thought I had some more ice spots. Oh, what a shame. Let's just activate our Techno Terrors. Speed up the destruction of these. Do I need ice again? Oh, I thought I iced them in the first place. Odd. Alright, that's pretty good. 
and activate ice so we can deal with the Moabs. It's probably a good thing that ice, the ice ability only affects two layers, otherwise it would be seriously broken. It'd be literally the ninja ability, but stronger, I mean cheaper. And it's permanent for the balloons currently on screen. Oh, here's another ice spot. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see indeed. Mm, no more there. What about here? What about this, like, bottom corner? Eh, probably not. Alright, do we give up on placing the ices? No, I, I don't think I should. I mean, if I happen to find one, that'd be great. I mean, odds are against me, but it doesn't harm anyone. How are your opinion on Jake Paul? I don't know. I don't watch his stuff, so honestly, I don't care. Seems like good advice for, you know, the... You know, some, some, it, sometimes it's just trendy to hate certain YouTubers. At that point, you just, just don't watch them, you know? Don't waste your anger on, like, someone who doesn't even know you exist. It's just not worth it. Oh, I saw that. Another one here? Another one. Another one? Mm, no other one. Oh, will you ever stream on Twitch again? You know, maybe someday. I think if I ever stream Hearthstone, there's a chance it would be on Twitch. But I think it's more likely for me to stream on YouTube still. It's just all my subscribers are here on YouTube. You know, everything. So, I have no reason to stream on Twitch. I'll get more, you know, publicity that way. And plus, in the end, I just want, you know, people to like, join on and be part of my channel. That'd be dope, yo. Okay, round 100, triple digits. This is excellent. Oops, I uh, probably should have slowed down to easy OMGs. Shouldn't I have? Uh, let's also make sure most of our temples are on strong. Do you want this guy on strong? I ain't gonna have him on strong. Strong, strong. First, strong. Okay, that's fine. Back to this ninja ability. Yeah, I think we're out of ice spots, boys. Alright, so 19 more rounds until the fabled 119. Oh my gosh. Now we play the waiting game. Realistically, it should be another 22 or 20 minutes or so if we make it that far. I'm excited to see if it works out. If you did a pre-update with Hypersonic Towers, could you get further? Oh, absolutely. Hypersonic Towers made it so easy to get uh, to high rounds in late game. You could, um, generally the strategy was to spam screen with villages. You also go Spike Factory, Sniper, and Ice. So the Spike Factory is the main popping power there. Spike Factory is so good with popping power under hypersonic villages. Because not only does it shoot so much faster, but its popping power doubles for every spike. So if you get the Moab Shredder spikes, and you have it under 20 hypersonic villages, its pile of spikes gets multiplied by 2 to the 20th, the, the, the size of a single spike and its attack speed goes to like, you know, 30, 30 times a second. It's insane. Honestly, absolutely ridiculous, right? So then the ice tower, so you just slow down the balloons. And Sniper is also good against under hypersonic village because you can use it to just have in infinitely stall the OMGs to give you spike piles more time to come back. You can probably get to round 200 with that setup as long as your computer and internet are good enough. Why is your name Alien's Rock 50? No offense, that seems cringy. No, I, I don't blame you. I made the username while I was in sixth, sixth grade, uh, back when I was known for having an alien voice by the peers in my middle school. It was legitimately, legitimately dumb, but they loved it regardless. So, 
at the time, I felt like a big shot. I'm like, yes, aliens are so cool. I'm going to name myself Aliens Rock 50. If you think that's bad, you, you, you would be terrified by my previous YouTube username. Before that, I made an account in fifth grade, and the username of it was Bucks Gift Card 990. What is that even? I honestly don't know. Have you tried Super Monkey Mortar Ice Sniper? I have not. I mean, I've only done this loadout. I don't think it's as good though, because the double stall in the uh, Ice and Ninja is so important. Getting the ZLMGs to one quarter of their speed, uh, it'll allow you to just defend so much longer. See, money, what is up? Welcome to the stream, dude. Welcome to the hashtag Epic Light Game. Yeah, actually, this is, this is uh, Bloom's TV. Hug your opponent. Oh, man. That is a great reference. Props to you, known. <laughs> Good old Haran reference. Yeah, I think my map is packed. We've done it. We filled up the map. All we have to do now is sell and revive the mortars. Also got two road spikes for some darn good reason. How do you get sandbox mode? Very carefully. You have to know what you're doing. You have to kind of know how to, like, mod the game. You feel? So, actually, what I'm doing right now, I'm trying to get the ZLMGs to stack on each other as much as possible. That way, my towers will overall, you know, as a whole, do better against the group. So, like, they'll hit multiple ZLMGs at once, and they'll pop more down the BFBs, and then more down the mortars, and do a lot better. What is your goal? That's uh, in the title, man. Read it and leave. It's a lot of moabs. I'm gonna wait for the next ZLMG to overlap. Perfect. Keep waiting for the next ZLMG to just overlap. Let that go. There we go. Look at those. Look at that ZLMG just total sandwich. They're just chilling on top of each other right now. Activate some more of these. Easy peasy. What's the best three towers? Like for a normal strategy? Ninja Farm Mortar is probably what you want to do. That's what most people use. It's not too hard to pick up, but it's not like an auto win. That's probably your best shot at winning the most games though, going Ninja Farm Mortar. Why'd you quit Roller Coaster Tycoon? Oh, that's a good question. I don't know. Just kind of got a little bit bored of it. A little tired of it, so I stopped playing. I mean, it was a lot of fun while it lasted, but I just really didn't have the time to continue. All right, legit, we are doing so much better this time than last time. Oh, we missed a few ZOMGs though, that's gonna suck. We missed a few at the Sabotage. So this time they're a bit more spread out. We may need to battle energy this time. Let's get our four tier more. I think I'm gonna sell this guy. I don't know. Activate some of these guys. Activate ice when needed. Slow these down. Acquire more ice. So yeah, the, the, the ZLGs are getting much less far this time. Wow. Yeah, it's incredible. Also, you want to activate the ninja ability right, right when you see the next round start. So you can be 110% sure you're... Uh... Alright, well that was close enough. 110% sure you're actually slowing down the ZLGs permanently. Alright, let them stack. I mean, they're kind of getting far now. It's really not that bad, though. Activate a bit more ice. Go for a secondary ninja, just to be safe. Do you still play BTD5? Not frequently, though. No. It's kind of an old game. I will play Bloons TD6, though. A lot. Ninja Farm Mortar can't defend Rainbow Rush well at all. That's not true. You just gotta get a 0-3 Mortar, then like a Bloon Jitsu, and boost... And, you know, having an extra 3-2 mortar is also very good. Would recommend. Just gonna keep activating the Techno Terrors because I can. And this round's actually almost, yeah, almost done. Keep stacking the ZOMGs. That's what I do. 
stacking them. And slowing down the bullets. Round 108. We are 11 rounds off of our goal. This is going pretty Gucci. If I say so myself. I think all these UMGs got perma stalled, right? Be better of. Just activate this now. Half yeah, decent timing. -ish. Damn, we don't even have to micro our mortar yet. At this point, last game, we were we were spamming the mortar ability. It was insane. Like we were using it so much, but now I haven't even I've hardly even used it legit. This all right? This game legit could go super far. I am really optimistic about this. Let's not, let's just not fuck up, okay? All right, I mean, we're, we're, we can gloat when we actually get the record. All right, some mods are kind of getting far though. Stall these. Slow them down. Might as well just use a mortar ability for safety. Okay, this is Gucci. Round 109. CMGs are kind of fast. Oh damn, I already activated my ninja ability on him. Like, I'm not sure if I already ninja abilityed. Damn. Alright, so this is definitely going to be a lot harder now. I don't think I'll need to energy, but I will need to start mortar stalling. In fact, I should probably start doing it this round. Mortar stall. Activate another ninja ability. And here we go. Here comes the micro boys. Where the... Okay. I'm gonna just road spike this now. For safety. Where's my mortar? Oh god. Activate mortar. Do I currently have one or something? What the... Jesus. Why can I not place this guy? Place. Place, 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 place. Holy shit. Okay, well that was ridiculous. I think I'm gonna sell this super monkey. I wanna I wanted to be able to place some mortar. And it's giving me issues. It's kind of annoying. It's okay, that super monkey wasn't too useful anyways. Yeah, now we'll just mortar stall everything. This is fine. This is alright. Exactly what I want. Alright, uh, this mortar stall is helping so much now. Uh, some of them are getting pretty far. I don't actually think all those ZMGs are dead. Damn. Oh, okay. Here comes more of them. Oh shit! Uh, I don't know if I had to. There was there's just some balloons getting really far. I wasn't sure. I really was not sure about it. Oh god! I don't know why I wasted a tower boost. I, that was definitely 110% a waste. That's fine. We can still probably defend. Oh god! Things are getting real scary right now. I keep having mortar placement problems. Why? Why game? Mortar placement problems. Because I didn't have that last game. I was doing a lot, going a lot smoother with my mortar micro last game. It's come to the point where I cannot afford to look to the at the chat anymore, otherwise I die. So, save your dank memes for later. Alright, a few more mobs here, no worries. And my hand is starting to cramp already. Shoot. It's okay, these mobs are going to be taken down. I handled this round a lot better than the last one. Thank God. Alright, round 12. We beat this and we uh, do better than how we did last, last game. Okay. Oh, I got a lot of Techno Terrors back. 
Let's go. Let's use them. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, now we begin the web slowing. Because ice ability won't last forever. Okay. Things are looking decent. Activate another one of these. Some ZMG is still making it really far, though. This is a lot of ability usage. Holy crap. I think I used uh, two ninja abilities way too close to each other. Alright, some mobs getting semi-far. Let's see if we need it. Oh, jeez. That's a BFB, I think. I think we can fend that without boosting. That's really scary. Holy crap. But it's okay. We got one round further than last time. And we continue on it. Okay. Still have not needed to energy. Again. Only had to once, but that was a mistake. Also, I need to activate Mortar more. Because the Moabs get insanely strong now. This is when it gets difficult. Oh, boy. I'm actually really nervous here. Keep activating Ice for when I can. Ninja. Ice. Mortar. Just going along the line of all the abilities. Let's go. Here's another one of these. Oh, these balloons are getting far. So many ZOMGs still. No, it didn't sell. No. Why? God, Micro is so sloppy right here. I think I have to energy this. They're getting so disgustingly far. Do I still have... I didn't sell my mortar. Are you kidding me? What the... What in the dicks? <gasps> I sold the temple! Are you kidding? No! Oh, no. We lost. I sold... Oh, no. I sold my, uh temple instead of my mortar. How did this happen? How could this possibly happen? We're about to die, too. Yeah, we lost. Round 114. I sold my temple and I didn't even realize it. I'm like, how is my mortar still here? Ah. We lost 150 lives, so we quit. Damn. Alright, we got two rounds further than how we would advise Ab. I also had a tower boost left I totally could have used. But it was all didn't matter when I sold the temple. Whoops. Ah, oh, man. Feels bad. It wasn't even like. I mean, it was a micro fail. It was a big misclick. It was the most disappointing misclick I've ever had. Damn. Now we just coasted out. No, you only lost 149. You were counting. Damn, man. I guess I needed more space for my mortar. Uh, how long is it going to be till we die? This is some of these OMGs. They only take out like 16,000 lives each. I can last a couple other rounds. God, did I sell anything else, including the temple? Man. That was definitely fun while it lasted, though. I also want the defeat screen to show up. So that's how I'm wet letting these go through. Are we going to make it around 117? Woo! Round 117. Damn. Would I have stood a chance if I didn't sell the temple? That is the question. Maybe if I was able to do insane mortar micro. I don't know. Maybe I, I think I think if I played it perfectly, I think I still would have been a couple rounds short of 119. <laughs> still good. We can still get the record. Damn. Ah. Sadly, could not be achieved. I guess I gotta end the stream here though. We've we've gone for three hours. This is ridiculous. That's a lot of hours. Plus I still stream tomorrow as well. Then I may stream and upload on Sunday. Like, holy crap. You know what guys, thanks for coming out for at least supporting me. You know, if it, if the <laughs> if the damn record was 111, we would have beat it twice over. But I guess uh I guess going for a sniper instead of mortar was probably the way to go. At least that's what uh Josh did. So I'll have to, if I ever go for another attempt, I think I'll try that loadout instead. 
So yeah. Love you all a long time. Be sure to go to Battles TV, upvote mine and ISAB's game. It was a pretty legit game. 75 minutes of hashtag epic light game. Probably more intense than the current one. Thanks all donators. Thanks everyone. Yeah. See you all next time. Peace out.